it's Tears of the Kingdom, it's Build a Stick Simulator 2023. I'm building a stick in Tears of the Kingdom. I want to make the ultimate stick. I might get a long stick and put the best spear on the end of it, and then that will be the greatest stick. Um, if you enjoy sticks, what is it? Comment down below what your favorite stick is. Could be long, brown, and sticky. A stick. Let's just play the game. Alright, uh, I made it off the sky platform. I'm running around. I got my- I got my wing shield. I got my- my stone axe, but that's not even my ultimate weapon. Whoa! Oh wait, that's- wait. Wait. I- wait, hold on. That's weird. I, I must have hit L by mistake. Cause it seemed like I had pulled it out and it just like, and, and it was like, ready to fuse! We do- we should probably get the long stick stick back. This is probably my best weapon right now. But I don't need it to take this thing down, so I'll keep- I'll keep the weak uh, weapon out for, uh, for now, until we gotta do stuff. At any rate, one thing- I think I'm gonna- I am gonna head over to Hyrule Castle right now. Just to get out of that out of the way. One- what I'm mostly trying to do is figure out what I can do to make the- this is a, Wow, this is a litany of Sky Islands. Uh, what I can do to make it so I can- if we look at the map here. I mean, we can kind of see stuff. I guess it's discovery based. I thought, uh, it must still be holding the, uh, the records from, uh, Breath of the Wild. Because the map is filled. I was- I was just wondering if I need to fill out the map again. Da na 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 da. Actually, where is this, uh, it's... Okay, it's close by. It's like, down there. Am I able to get in through the front gate? I can move the gate! Open the gate! Just like Magnesis. Meanwhile, this guy's gonna be like, huh? Who's there? Hey, this area's off limits while we're conducting our search for Princess Zelda and Link. You can't just come wandering in here like that. Link? It's you? I'm sorry, I had no idea that you had returned. Wait, if you're back, does that mean we don't need the search party anymore? Huh. You should go talk to Captain Haas. He's leading search efforts, uh, uh here from the first gatehouse up ahead. You'll find it at the very end of this road. Alright, uh... Okay, so yeah, probably should sneak to try to catch the glow flies. Oh my god. I didn't even realize in that first dungeon that you could use the hook to, uh, to get it, as opposed to, you know, uh, playing Tony Hawk's Pro Skater. I wouldn't mind it if it combined these a little bit better. Captain Haas? Are you Captain Haas? Link? No, it can't be him. I can't allow anyone to pass here. The area is restricted to only those involved in the search for Princess Zelda. This is by direct order of Captain Haas. If you insist on passing, you'll need permission from the captain. He should be in the first gatehouse at the end of this road. Oh, at the end of the road, okay. Gotta go back in time. Ba 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 da! Ba da ba ba da ba da! I'm gonna cause problems on purpose by coming up here. There was a skink! I mean, there was a... There was a skink... He was a, it was a skink... Was that a skink? It might have been a skink. Oh, wait! If that's... Yeah, oh, if that's where Captain Haas is, then maybe I could just Metal Gear my way in here and get past the guard, eh? Oh! What now would be funny? Ooh! Traveler shield. Seems like a lot of the traveler's items are the only things to have made it through the, uh, the, the gloom. Thus, searching Hyrule Castle probably won't be, uh, a very fruitful endeavor. For, like, for weapons. Well, even if I can get to it, it's kind of up there now. Are you the captain? Ah. We've turned up nothing in here that would help us find the princess, unfortunately. Huh. 
You're the spinning image of Link. Bet if Captain Oz saw you, he'd even be so startled by fall off the gatehouse over there. Uh, I'm Yutas. He's too busy, I guess. Oh. Did you come up here to look for Princess Zelda too? Yeah, me and a few others had the same idea. We all owe a great deal to the princess. We were hoping to help anyway. Uh. But the captain is way up on top of the gatehouse there. It doesn't look like he's coming down anytime soon. He just showed up but without being asked, so, uh... We just showed up without being asked, so uh, best to stay out of the way until we can help somehow. Incredible! <gasps> Standing at the edge of the... of, uh... And staring it in is intense. Seeing the chasm in person is far better than hearing about it. Whoa! Whoa! Why would you do that? Just up and startle me at the edge of the void. This chasm is near bottomless, just like the, all the others created by the upheaval. Personally, I do not want to be hit, uh, hit the bottom of a nearly bottomless chasm. Even though it scares me, I can't stop staring at it. It's like a train wreck. He's at the top, hey? He's probably trying to get away from the, as much of the gloom as possible. People falling ill and whatnot. The first gatehouse. A torch! Can't carry any more melee weapons, though. Do I have anything I could- I can chuck? Oh, I don't want the flame emitter shield. That'd be crazy. Uh... I guess I'll keep what I got. Torch could be useful, but either way. Oh, wait, are these fresh weapons? Hello! Soldier's broadsword and soldier's spear. That's definitely better than the, uh, the rusted, uh, halberd. Anything else I could drop for this sake? The rusty broadsword is actually a little bit better. That said, though, I could make a spear spear. Uh... <clears throat> actually, hold on. Let me... Drop this, pick up this. There we go. The longest stick! <laughs> It'd be funny if it's like I walk in here and it's like, clang. <laughs> Just like I thought, the weapons here have all decayed too. What if there are any intact weapons left in the world? What about the weapons? Hey, it's a new face. Nice trailby, buddy! During the upheaval, all the weapons, swords, spears, claymores, you name it, suddenly decayed. I've explored many regions in search of weapons that might be still be intact. I found none. At this point, I'd be surprised there were any intact weapons left in Hyrule. Oh. They're also a real pain to repair, so the best thing we could do is strengthen them. I'll do the same thing with this one. Because, in the case of... From my understanding, <laughs> if I do this, then the... what Whatever is on the end will break first. Alright, let me try to get up to the captain. <laughs> All right, we got a sword sword, we got a spear spear. You know, I wouldn't mind a club club or uh, I, hey, actually a club club sounds like a sandwich. So that that's all that's all fine by me. And it's all very fine by Krug. By Krug standards, this is the best opportunity and option for all and for none. You say he's all, like all the way on top. I just realized that climbing is potentially the sucker's way, as I could probably just burrow my way through it. Oh, oh! Ascend! Watch me swoosh right in! Swoosh, swoosh! Uh, they said he was on top, but that seemed to have been proven to be a lie. And of course, there's a Korok. Uh, I probably only want to find as many Koroks as I would need in order to get the, uh, the maximum. Whoa! There are two varieties of Korok! 
There's sky cork and ground cork. The sky corks have red leaves. <clears throat> yeah, you found me. Bye -bye. Oh! Bad idea. Big mistake. Big mistake. Bad idea. Bad idea. Big mistake. Big mistake. There he is. Uh, just in case I'm a little bit too high up. Let me eat some whittles. The peppers do a good job. Sorry, but I'm in the middle of something. Huh? Link, is that you? You're alive! In all one piece, it looks like! This up front. I, I just, uh, when I was editing, I noticed that I was peak. my mic was peaking, so I want to make sure it's not happening. Does that mean Princess Zelda's safe too? What a relief. Huh? Hang on, you're alone? But you heard the princess calling out to you and you've he uh, you're here to help with the search. I see. Uh, maybe I don't. I'm a little confused, but that doesn't matter right now. What matters is continuing our search for Princess Zelda. Hmm. I'm relieved to see you come up here to help us through. To help us, though, we need some good news. The sheer amount of gloom has gotten overwhelming. Our work carries on. We've hit, uh, we've been a bit dead in the water. Oh. Captain, it's Princess Zelda! Hmm? Princess Zelda, she's safe! Wait, what? Huh? You saw that too, Link. You saw the Princess Zelda turn into light and fly off, right? <laughs> sir, I'd like to re recommend that this might be a glitch, sir! How strange. This, this is an emergency situation. Hmm. Why would you leave without saying a word to us? We need to let Pyrrha know as soon as possible. Considering what we just witnessed, I think it may make sense for us to withdraw, but it'll take a bit. Please, you must tell Piro what happened here as soon as possible. Everyone, let's withdraw! I actually do want to... Before heading back there, I kind of want to see what's over where uh, where uh. Zelda was. 100 bits from uh, Pri Private Butter for Christ saying, Sir, it appears that Zelda... <laughs> uh. Sir, it appears that Zelda's experienced a cra- <laughs> Oof! Oof! Oh, man. Oh, buddy. I mean, oh, boy. Extreme Labs is doing that thing again where I can't see. When the it's weird, because it, if the alert goes off, then it won't appear on Streamlabs, but if it doesn't go off, then it will. I can see it now, okay. Talos with the 68 months of Prime, thank you very much. I missed that one from before. Woo! It'll do that sometimes. There might be something up here, too. Oop, there's a, there's a skink. He was a small 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 skink. Hi, tail lizard. He was a tiny little tiny 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 skink. He was a small skink. He was a small skink. Ooh, this goes against the norm for where the rock would be. Okay, it wasn't that high up. I was afraid. I was most afraid. I was mostly afraid. I was kind of afraid. I wasn't afraid. Huh? 
Oh god, that's gotta be killer on his hands to like cl cling to the wall like that. I wanted to see. I hope I hope we find like a steering mechanism or some at some point. There's another high tail lizard down there, so might as well get it. Then we'll teleport back. He was it. Wait. Oh, it left. It must have heard me coming. Dang. We lost the skink. All right. Um. The Kenosis Shrine. The Geonosis Shrine. I wonder what you- because you could fuse all manner of things to weapons and armor. I should try fusing a glider to a- to a sword. Uh... Central Square of Hyrule Field. That's the castle. I want to go back to... Uh, I want to go back to the Pyropad. Traveler's Claymore, Traveler's Spear. Oh! Wait. The Traveler's Spear Spear. Uh, if that's the case... Destroy Fuse Material. Oh, that's what I had fused to it before. Well, okay, whatever. <laughs> spear, 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 spear. Alone in the world, it's a little spear, spear. Do I have anything that's not fused? Because I'm wondering, oh my god! We can have a wheel spear, a, uh, a lumber spear, a board spear. A big board spear. Or, uh, sorry, a sword. These are- this is a sword. A rusty broadsword broadsword. Yeah, we don't have the master sword. We either sent it through time, or we sent it somewhere else. Judging by the fact, though, that that cutscene had the- the remains of the Master Sword, uh, passing through light and dark areas, days and nights a-goin'. Z got owned by standing next to a stone candle while getting Taco Bell. Oh, Z. Ah, I can see one of my deaths very close by. Hey, Robbie. Oh, what a fine afternoon. Hey, hey you! Do you have any idea how worried we've been? So that's the arm, huh? I overheard Para talking about it. Hmm, I see. Yeah, it's pretty weird, all right. Hmm, nope, now's not the time for distractions. Got, that's gotta wait till later. Anyway, I hear you've got yourself the Pyropad now. You know that Pyropad of yours can get a lot more powerful. I know its real potential. I've got big plans for that device, but at first I need to help Joshua with her investigations into the depths. Squirrel King, thank you for gifting a tier one sub. Ah, Bingo! the depths. Bingo! But then, oh yes, then I will head. Uh, I will head back to the lab at Hateno Village and resume my research. So once I finish up here, you should join me there. You have a fast means of transportation. All the horses appear to be extinct. Hmm. Link, well, did you find anything? No, uh, so. Uh, Princess Zelda telling me Princess Zelda was at the castle and then she transformed into light and flew off? That's about the gist of it. I'm pretty sure it's a glitch in reality. I've got to say, your stories are always so wild. But if you're telling me that's what you saw, then I've got to believe it. Hmm. Sounds like we need to change our approach. Since the princess flew off, maybe we should redirect our efforts and dig into the upheaval, for now at least. I've already got a few regions in mind to start exploring. I bet we'll pick up clues where she flew off uh, to as we look around. <gasps> oh yeah, you still got the pure pad, right? Can I see it for a sec? Hmm? It's a little worse for wear, but seems to be functioning fine. Map, 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 aha! Mm -hmm. Oh right, I forgot that before we could look at your overall map of Hyrule, we need to add map data from uh, right around Lookout Landing, and for that, we need our Skyview Tower. Josha, 
What's the status of the Skyview Tower right now? <laughs> Let me see. Outwardly, the structure looks to be complete. Ah. Oh, but the travel point is still undergoing final adjustments. Hmm. Travel point needs tweaking. Sounds like I better get cracking. Ah. Sorry about this, Linky. I'll fix it up quick, uh, so just hang on tight. In the meantime, why don't you rest up? You must be pretty tired. The emergency shelter is just the spot for you. It has free beds and a kitchen, so it's well and uh, well stocked for getting some rest and rejuvenating yourself. If you want more info, mm -hmm. talk to the soldier who's watching over everything from the center, right where the emergency shelter entrance is. If you need clothing for your travels, ah. you should go to Mub's shop. I'll be over by Skyview Tower, so just uh. So, uh, so when you're ready to head out, just let me know. Yeah. All right, Josha, let's work on our final preparations for the tower. I'll handle the travel point. Check it. Josha, you're in charge of the switch. Woohoo! Okay, Doc, you can count on me. All righty. Down we go. Lookout Landing Skyview Tower huh? from Hyrule Field. Link! Glad to see you back, Link. My name is Scorpus. I have uh, been in charge with managing Lookout Landing. If you have any questions about the place, any at all, come right to me. I will answer as best as I can. Ah. We just have one rule and one rule only. No sex in the emergency shelter. Now please, allow me to open up the emergency shelter. But not for sex, just for sleeping. You. Hey, it's me, open up! You know, that's a good password. Ah. This underground vault used to be an emergency shelter for the royal family. Now we're using it, uh, now we're making constant use of it. Feel free to make yourself at home in our vault. Use any equipment you want. I forgot the password. Oh wait, no I didn't. I'm the fucking monarch. Let me in. <laughs> What to do? Hey. hey, welcome! It's your first time at my store, right? It's the only place to shop here uh, in Lookout Landing. I know it's a little thrown together, but I stock a nice selection of uh, of goods. I ran a store back in my hometown, so I hope you'll uh, support my place here. Your hometown? Oh. I come from a small fishing town called L uh, Lurlin Village. Oh, in the south! Okay. It's way so south in the southeastern corner of a Hyrule. It used to be a peaceful place, too. Then the pirates arrived. I used to run the village's general store. Ooh, pirates. But when those pirates arrived, I had to grab all the goods I couldn't run. I, I don't know how it's going there now. I hope I can return someday, but for now, I'll just keep selling as much as I can. Please, I'd like to, uh, let me know if there's anything you'd like. Anything else you need? Buy my stuff. Oh. I can sell stuff should the need arise. Interesting. At, at the very least, she doesn't buy gemstones. Zonite's way too precious. What's the most valuable thing I have? Zonite charges are each six rupees, and they're they're a dime a dozen. How much how much are the armors? I I, I can't imagine I can imagine them being like mad at, like all the stuff usually is pretty expensive. Uh, seventy rupees, one hundred and thirty rupees, one hundred twenty. So three hundred twenty rupees for the entire set. Uh, I'm at least gonna get the Hylian hood because, uh... Ah. Oh. Let's see, I've got 20 right now, so why don't I sell... These are kind of a dime a dozen. I don't want to sell them all, though. I'll sell 100 rupees worth. Oh. If I could pick up two items off of here, I, off this rack, I'd be, I, I'd feel great. Uh, I would need 80 more rupees for that, though. And it doesn't look like I'll be able to swing that. Actually, yeah, the, I don't need this many bright bloom seeds.
I don't think. We'll sell 45 of them. Ooh, you can sell cooked food as well. And armor? Wait, really? You must be able to get duplicates or something. Not interested? All right, anything else you can, uh, okay. Uh, I want the, t because the pants provided cold resistance, I'm gonna get the tunic and I'm gonna get the hood. So generous of you, you made me very happy, sir. All right, let's take a look at our new wares here. First, I wanna see how the hood looks with, uh, with uh, this garb. Doesn't match very well. Having a hood to cover your face and having an exposed chest doesn't look great. This, however, looks fine. Alright, uh, well, I've got better equipment now, so I should be able to take some hits better. Ooh. Some shrooms growing under there. Oh! Oh, dang. Oh, there's a quest here. Oh. Hey, are you new here? You may scoff, but I know a fresh face when I see one. I can say that because I'm a newcomer too. My name is Bermano. Uh, they put me in charge of cooking for some reason. I want to say something fancy like for today's menu, we have a fruit and mushroom mix that'll rev you right up. Oh. Yeah, I was really looking forward to saying that, but... I'm plum out of apples. I don't know, uh... I don't have my most, uh, most important ingredient. Say goodbye to rich, full flavor. Hmm, <gasps> my nose is detecting an, uh, a sweet, tangy, a pleasant aroma. Could it be... Do you have an apple? There you go. Wow, you're really generous. I'm giving you first crack at some grub. Hold on a second. At least you didn't fail it. But na 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 na. I'm calling it Bermano's special fruit and mushroom mix. Looks tasty, doesn't it? Fruit and mushroom mix. I make it. I make. I like to make a big deal out of it, but anyone can make it. All you need is a is an apple, a mushroom, and a pot. You should try making some. Today's menu side quest complete. I want to go on survey. <gasps> no, you, no, you're not who I think you are. Ooh. Hey, I know that face. And any face I know uh, is the face of a friend. Please, Link, help yourself uh, to anything in this shelter. It's all yours to use as you see fit. Mm. But don't you dare go making a mess of the place and kicking up dust. Spent so much time cleaning in here, and there's still endless amounts of dust. Where does all this dust even come from, anyway? I'm done. I'm really done. Nope, nope, nope. I'm not going not going near get chasms anymore. Nasty gloom is everywhere, making everyone sick, making me sick. Glad I ate that yellow plant stuff from the gloom specialist. Any more gloom and I'd be canoeing down old, down old Death River. Work my tail off for Josha. Kid runs circles around Pure and Robbie. She loves research. Me, I'm sick to death of chasm research. At least I'm starting to feel better. But I think I'll lie, lie low and keep and keep lying here. Oh, Link, right? You really are that Link guy, aren't you? I heard folks talking about you, and your face matches the one on the poster. Oh, sorry, you wanted a bed, yeah? You can go ahead and take whatever empty bed you like. Ah. Uh. Nappin, uh, Nappin's sleep talking is particularly audible here, so you probably want a bed farther from him. His physical condition has been deteriorating ever since he investigated one of the chasms. That's despite how long he's been back, which has been quite a while. He still hasn't made much of a recovery. We know about the chasms already. Oh. You're welcome to rest here and use any of the resources you see fit. Pure has made it a standard policy that anyone who needs shelter here has it. She want, uh, she says it's what Zelda would want. Hey, I can level up here. It's a Hylia, or, uh, yeah, Hylia statue. Huh? Huh? Oh, it's you, Link. Pardon me for not, uh, for being lost in my work here. This map tends to get all my attention. Hmm. Are you interested in the different peoples of Hyrule and where they live? That's my entire field of study. I went to Hyrule U. When I'm out of deployment with Monster Control Crew, I spend hours poring over our maps. As such, I'm the most knowledgeable in lookout landing about Hyrule's various peoples and their towns and villages. It's various peoples? Oh. Aside from us Hylians, there are four other peoples in Hyrule. The Rito, the Gorons, the Zora, and the Gerudo. Each live in a different area and have their own unique traits, whether it's soaring the sky or feasting on rocks. Mm. We Hylians also live in villages that reflect our unique cultures. The Sheikah are known for their wisdom. Uh, in fact, our most prolific researchers are among them. The leader of Lookout Landing, Pura, is from the Sheikah tribe. Towns and villages? Oh. Hyrule has eight major places that its various peoples call home. Cutscene. 
Lookout Landing is located here in Central Hyrule. We use the special glowing ink that reacts to whatever it's being talked about. Up northwest here uh, uh. is the Rito Village in Hebra. Uh, 100 bits from Greg Greg Manson saying, Here is the map. Where do you wish to go? The, the Gerudo town is located the southwest in the Gerudo region. You'll find Gorob City, Goron City to the northeast in Elden. Travel a bit east and you'll come to Terrytown across in a co Oh, Terrytown! Not too far from there you'll, uh, is Zora's Domain. That's within the Lanero region. Hmm. Continuing to the southeast of Hyrule, you'll come across a cluster of Hylian villages. These are all within the area known uh, called Nekluda. In that cluster, you'll find Kakariko Village, where the Sheikah live. I hear the village leader is quite lovely. If you're seeking a tranquil sp- Oh my god, Impa retired! Or died, but either way. If you're seeking a tranquil spot, Hateno Village is worth a visit. I also hear it's become Hyrule's center of fashion. Finally, there's Lurlin Village. It's a wonderful gateway destination. Many of the aforementioned towns and villages have been deeply affected by the upheaval. If removing even a fraction of the monsters helps soothe the peoples of Hyrule, then what? Uh, that's what we'll do. Our monster control crew is on patrol each and every day. I'm gathering information for everyone everywhere. What about you? Oh. I work with the monster control crew. We're tasked with protecting everyone from monsters. There's been an uptick in their population since the upheaval. But I'm not really the most skilled in combat. So instead I use my knowledge of the, of the areas to help determine where we should make deployments. Uh, I'm gonna butcher this name. When's When's Ladalia Lover? Uh, thirty-four. Thank you for the prime sub and USN Mercer Holt with the five hundred bits saying, "Just walked a mile from a truck stop. I parked at to pick up this game. I can't wait to play it. It's fun." Oh my god, he's, you're right, his name is Atmos, because he's looking at an atlas. That's already fused. All right, weapons man. Oh. oh, hey, is that you, Link? I'm a nose down, so I don't know what's happening around me half the time. This is pretty involved, so I'm going to keep keep, uh, keep sitting here while I wrench this uh. in. Might have heard, but when the upheaval happened, all the weapons decayed. I poured so much energy into trying to fix them, but it's been no use. Uh. Oh, yeah. In case nobody's mentioned it, you're welcome to, to, to the weapons over there. Though there probably won't be much of use since they, uh, uh, they're, you guessed it, decayed. There we go. I just realized that the notifications are over my face. Interesting. Very interesting. The missing posters for me and Zelda. Oh. It's the same Hyrulean script, and yet so different from our modern language. I still have a lot to learn. Hmm? Hmm? Don't tell me. Based on your stature, physique, and distinctive right arm, you must be Link. Wensleydale is how you pronounce that. Oh, like from, um, uh, what is it? From Wallace and Gromit. Well, it's not from Wallace and Gromit. Wensleydale is a cheese company that was saved by Wallace and Gromit. Pura has told me so much about you. I'm Wartsworth. My research specialty is ancient Hyrulean. Mm. And by ancient Hyrulean, I don't mean the text found in the ring ruins, but something different. It's what we call the language used at the time of Hyrule's founding. Our modern language is built on that foundation. Mm. These books here are written in ancient tongue. They look like gibberish to your average Hyrulean. Are you curious about ancient Hyrulean? I don't have anything to show uh, as it stands now. Mm. But I'm sure I'll someday have results posted and ready uh, for all to see at the lab in Kakariko Village. Hmm. Stilton? Winsleydale? Oh, I don't know, Grom, and it's not like any cheese I've ever eaten before. Cheese, Gromit! 
What was that? The name of that short? It was like a a, a day out or something like that. We'll sleep until until morning. We'll you you know you can sleep until what I did in, into the late afternoon. A grand day out. Bingo! Boom, dears! Thank you for gifting a tier one sub to R and R Gaming AU. All right. Since I've uh, uh, since I, I need to sleep as part of my accomplishment here. Half pint anomaly. Think of it three months of tier one. Let's go talk to the not so pint sized Pura, and see if she's finished up with a uh, with the teleportation device. Put this here, and that goes there. No, no, that's not quite it. Uh -huh. That should do it. Ah. Hey, Link, you all set? I just wrapped up th uh, things here. The travel point will work fine now, or it will be once you do your part. Hey! We're ready, Joshua. Pull the switch. Hey! Okay, one thing that I was concerned about was that Sheikah technology would have all been offline because of the upheaval. But that doesn't appear to be the case. Did she just launch a goddamn satellite? Oh god, it's Skylink. Oh! All the Skyview Towers have been activated! Yeah! Okay, Link, your turn. Go ahead and hold the Pura pad over that terminal. <laughs> I, I love how they're just like, <laughs> you know what, Pura's design in Age of Calamity was such a hit, we're just gonna use it again for this game. So she, here's the thing, she got it under control. She got the aging thing under control, but kind of a little bit too well, to be perfectly honest. All right, the Skyview Tower is now active on your map. That means you can use this travel point to get here anytime instantly. Same is uh, true for every Skyview Tower you add to the Pura Pad. <laughs> Impressive, right? <gasps> but Skyview Towers are more than about more than just traveling quickly. Their primary function is to survey the area, or simply put, to make a map. The Pura Pad works with the Skyview Tower and scans the topography directly onto the map. Pretty great, huh? Hmm. Only thing is, you need a paraglider when you're scanning. Takes a lot of skill and nobody here has what it takes. To be honest, that's why we haven't tested this out yet. We needed you. Which brings us to this. Thank God! Mm -hmm. Right, it's showtime! Let's start with a test scan. Now's the time for the very first test launch. I mean, our first test. Just step over there in the circle and uh, find me afterward, all right? Uh -huh. I'll be observing for the research lab. Yeah. When the test scan is over, we'll have a final briefing on the uh, on the search for Princess Zelda. I also need to update your map with uh, places where the upheaval has wreaked the most havoc. Best of luck. Well, that's not the right place. So I just stand here and... Pura! Pura! I've seen enough hentai to know where this is going, Pura! Pura! Ah! Ah! <laughs> Perfect. Perfect. I NEVER LEARNED HOW TO READ!
Ah, The Adventures of Link, the Human Satellite. I'm so glad I've got the wing shield. Uh, Link? Link, the ground is coming, Link! 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 So, this is how I die, huh? What is that? Some funky energy over there that I never noticed before. I can at least discover the, uh, the, um... The that thing. There's a gloom pit! Discovery! Hyrule Field Chasm! As well as... It didn't give me- there we go. The Geosyn Shrine. Is it safe? Most definitely not. But I've got a fast pass back here. Oh. No, Traveler, don't do it if you touch that well! It'll sap your strength and you'll end up like me! Too sluggish to move! What do you got, buddy? Please be careful! If you touch the gloom, it'll sap your strength, you'll end up like me, too sluggish to move. I'm curious, like, what that does. Ooh, and I don't recover them, huh? Oh no, I do after a small period of time, but it still damages me. Traveler, are you feeling okay? Folks call this stuff gloom. If you care about your health, you best not go near it. If you get any on you, start losing your strength. It's like sapping your life away. Mm. I touched some gloom while poking around the depths, and now look at me. You recover from the worst of it on your own little by little, so long as you're on the surface. But while you're in the depths, you won't recover at all. Thought I was going to die down there. <sighs> some investigation leader I turned out to be. This is just pitiful. Mm. There's no way I can make uh, Davil work alone in the rain. I need to recover pronto. All right, if the, I'll heal up if this is a combat mission. Shape rotation. Oh. <clears throat> different shapes of pegs and different holes. There we go. And now I have a, uh, bridge. Kind of. There we go. Da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da
Um, can I climb it? I cannot climb it. Huh. Uh. Seems to be the best I can do with it. Am I able? Will I be able to get up there? Yes. Did you tell him to try working the shaft? Yes, sir. G good work, Nail. A hasty elixir. It won't heal me, but dang if it isn't hasty. All right. Okay. Uh... Let's see... Let me try. It's gotta go through there. Let me let me take a look at the other side to see if there's something else in there. Okay, yeah, no, it definitely has to come through there. Uh Ah, I see it now. Keep hitting the button to throw my stuff. Wish I could just rebind everything. I was about to like be a little bit of uh, a little bit peeved by that. I did it! I put the square in the hole. And now I didn't even have to use any healing items. Scrumpy! I got a blessing of light! May the blessing of light you seek guide your path, yada yada yada. All that jazz, get the hell out. My wife and I were just about to fornicate. And yet you have the gall to come in here. Got a little camp over here. Mm? Hey there, you're a bit late, hmm? <gasps> oh, you're a member of the monster control crew! Sorry, we're just, uh, formed. So I'm not overly familiar with everyone's faces. Oh. As we speak, squad leader of the monster control crew led by Haas is carrying on a mission nearby. Ah. If you go south on that road, you can see them in action. They're assaulting a monster stronghold. I'm just here for logistical support, tending to the horses, making elixirs. Come to think of it, I did make some extra elixir. Why don't you take some? Might come in handy on your travels. Tough elixir. Mm -hmm. Candidly, I'm a little worried about this mission. The new members didn't get much in the way of training. I wish someone with experience fighting monsters was there to help out. Hey, there are horses. A lot of blue horses. Let's tame that black stallion. I know Steven and Mal are playing this right now, so I I see it. So there's a there's a manatee right next to a kepi. I weigh my head back and forth. I weigh my head back and forth. Ho ho. Ho ho. Ho ho. Ho ho. Ho ho. 
Now I just need to find somewhere to put uh, to put him. Uh, maintenance is crucial. Hi. Sorry, I'm a little preoccupied right now with travelers right now. That's what you are, right, a traveler? It isn't safe here. Captain Haas's squad of the monster controlled crew is going to engage monsters around here soon. I bet you by now they're already locked in combat with some monsters in the lair in the south. I'm not gonna stop you for when I watch the sparks fly, but at least take some precautions first. All right, let's go, Dugong. Here come to town, come to save the Princess Zelda. Which way was this? I think they said it was down this road, right? Yeah, because it was like on the way here. Do all these people have their own names? Hi. Link, hello! Last time we moved to Hyrule Castle, if I remember right, like a day ago. Hmm. I'm Haas, captain of the squad of one of the monster control crew. Uh, after our search party for Princess Zelda Hyrule Castle, I returned to my monster fighting duties. Oh. At the moment, we're closing in on a monster stronghold up ahead. Once we approach their base, we'll wait uh, for the right opportunity to then launch our attack. Oh. I apologize if I'm being presumptuous, but ringing to you feels like fate. I must say, nothing would be more encouraging than to have you, Hyrule's best swordsman, to assist us. If we work together, I'm sure we can bring peace back to the land. You guys are kind of charging in head on right now. I'm just gonna start the attack. Hi, guys! <laughs> Did that wrong. Uh... Spear, spear, go! Yeah! I need to eat. Sword spear, go. Come on! Eh, eh. Yoda! <laughs> Victory's ours! Bravo, everyone! Hi. Link, I'm so grateful for everything you did for us. If you don't mind, could you come here a moment? I wanted to. I wanted to, to loot their base, though. Mm. Just incredible! No monsters match for you, eh, Link? Oh. Come to think of it, Link. I was told that you wield a special sword, one more magnificent than all the others. I don't mean to be rude, but your weapon doesn't seem that all that different from ours. Oh. What I heard about reveals the power when wielded by someone worthy. Could that be it? Ah, well, I'll be the first to admit when there's a gap in my knowledge. Mm. Ah, I'm so very sorry. I nearly forgot something very important. Hello! It's part of the bounty given to the monster control crew, so please don't hesitate to accept it. Ooh. We plan to head to southeast after this, to Fort Hateno in Ecluda. I hope I get a chance to fight beside you again. Hey. May you fight with God as highly as divine protection, brave swordsman. Bring peace to Hyrule Field. <laughs> Alright, let me go, let me go loot this camp then. Cause there's still plenty of monster parts and, uh, and various other things around here. A sturdy wooden stick.
Oops, I didn't mean to hit that. Boko, Boko Horn, Boko Horn. Soldier's Broadsword. Oh, hello. Nope, 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 nope. Sturdy Six Stick! Drop this so I can get a better... I get the Traveler's... Or the Soldier's Sword. That's uh, significantly better. Uh, 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 there we go. Where is the, where'd the, where's the, where'd the moblin die? Ooh, blue bacoblin horn. Two pronged horn with sharp edges attached to a weapon to bro to moderately increase the uh, attack power or brew it into an elixir. Another shield. The blue bacoblin. There we go. Moblin horn. Hard horn result in the skull mutation. Attached to a weapon to increase attack power. Cook it uh, with a critter. Now let's see. You know, I think I'll actually augment. Do I have any? Do I have a spear? No, I ran out of spears. Okay. I should augment the Zotai sword. Uh, the Zonite sword, rather. Um. Let me see. These don't actually give much attack power. You probably have to, like, refine them in some way. Let me go ahead and sort, because I want to see what, what monster parts I have that can help me out here. Attack power three. Attack power five. Four. Four. Attack power seven? Good lord. Oh, the Zonite sword must be combined with the Zonite tool. That makes sense. All right, I've I've raided here enough. We're good. It's fine. Uh, there were other weapons. You know, a good way to find weapons is because they'll be highlighted. <laughs> Whoops! That's the axe. That's a shield. Okay, I think I, I think I've raided here enough. All right. In the meantime, I should go back and report my findings to. Wait, when did I die in the? I I don't remember dying in the village. I could take these parts on my own. I fell. And then he fell and he died. All right. Oh, right. I keep forgetting this thing is multiple stories. All right. Hello. Uh -huh. Welcome back. That was some good gliding up there, Link. I expected nothing less. So how did it go? Did you get a proper map scan? Uh -huh. Good. That map is crucial to our search. There are Skyview Towers in every region of the world. You'll want to make a point of visiting them all. All right. Let's talk about the upheaval. It's affected more than just the castle. Reports of other strange phenomena have been coming in from all over Hyrule. Let's take a look at your map. The first report comes from Hebra to the northwest. I wonder if that's in the, the, um, Rito village. Next is in Elden in the northeast. I wonder if that's at Death Mountain. The Gerudo are reporting some trouble in the southwest. I wonder if that's in Gerudo village. Finally, uh, the Laneru in the east. I wonder if that's coming from Zora's domain. The phenomena are the strange phenomena are concentrated in these four regions. Can't say for certain, but got a nagging suspicion that we might find more about Princess Zelda by looking into these phenomena. Hmm. Hey, Doc, I don't know if this is helpful, but I heard something weird the other day. 
It was about someone who might have seen Princess Zelda at Rito Village in Ebro recently. Hmm. That is pretty weird, yeah. Generally speaking, I don't put much stock into hearsay, but this does sound like it's worth looking into. Ah. Oh, and before I forget, Link, we've asked the Lucky Clover uh, Gazette to help us in the, uh, the search for Princess Zelda. There's nobody who knows more about the goings-on in Hyrule than them. If you can find them to the entrance to Rito Village, you go there, you should speak to the editor. I'm sure she could help out in some way, too. Mm -hmm. I'll be directing a variety of investigations into the upheavals, many chasms, and new ruins. I'll also be looking for some different- I lost my horse, I just realized. I'll also be looking into some different villages. Someone somewhere might have, uh, might know what, what's happened to the princess. Yeah. I'm counting on you to check out major phenomena that are troubling the regions around Hyrule Link. Uh, find Princess- we'll find Princess Zelda one way or another. Gotta find Goggles. Oh. Sorry, I can't talk now. There's something I gotta discuss with Goggles right away at a research in terms of chasm. Let's talk later, but you have a quest! But you have a quest! But you have a quest! Are you referring to- Are you referring to Robin as Goggles? Or Robbie, rather? Gotta find Goggles. Son of a- Come on, please. What a- Ah, oh, what a pleasant evening. Oh, it's you. You know, that parapet of yours may seem perfect, but it can be even more perfect. Oh, I've- we've been over this. Come on, goggles! Oh, uh, yes. Sorry, you were saying? I was saying I want to go investigate the depths. Look, if you're not going to listen to me, I'll go and jump into a chasm myself. No way, no how! You can't do that! The depths are far too vast for you to explore on your own, and we've only barely begun to look into them! I'd love to go gallivanting around down there, too. Who knows what wonders are at the bottom of those chasms? But no matter how wondrous they may be, it's far too dangerous for you! I'm not about to let, uh, our young prodigy uh, to go wandering around somewhere unknown so foul! If anything would have happened to Pyrrha's favorite student, then it'd be the end! Uh, it'd be the end for me! The end! But I need more on that figure! If we, uh, have more info on it, then it should help us better understand the depths. Figure? Huh. Oh, Swordsman! Sorry, I didn't mean to leave you out of the conversation. Joshua, head of depth research. Depth research. Yeah. Let me get you up to speed. Our survey team brought back some artifacts to, uh, from a journey to the depths. One of them caught my eye. Is it an amiibo? An ancient amiibo. I got something stuck in my teeth. And it's really bugging me. Got it. It's a piece of slate, specifically the image depicted on it. Hmm. See that figure uh, standing on two legs with one arm raised up? Yeah, it looks like he's flipping the bird to somebody. Well, I have a theory. Could be evidence that mysteri a mysterious people once lived in the depths. Uh -huh. That's why I want to go down there. So I can see if there are any more depictions like this one. I want to see for myself. Huh. But Goggles here says it's too dangerous. He won't let me go. Joshua, come on now! I'll tell you what, I'll go down there myself and see if I can't find anything about the figure on the slate. And Link will join me! We'll start by looking for anything down there that resembles the figure on the slate. Assuming we find what you're looking for, we'll use uh, the, the Parapad's camera to take a picture of it for Joshua. A perfect plan. You don't know about the camera? It's one of the Parapad's basic features. With the camera, you can capture nearby scenery as an image. One that's stored in your pad there. Sounds like you still have more to learn about the Puripad. Well, that will teach you how to take pictures once we're down there, anyway. There'll be lots of monsters in the depths, though, so I'll be counting on you to keep me safe. Let's see. I guess we should enter th uh, through the chasm in the south of Lookout Landing. I'll go on ahead. Once uh, you're ready and ready to go, come find me there. Ta-ta! What? Wait, hang on. He's gone, isn't he? <sighs> Looks like he's gone. Sorry you got roped into all this, Swordsman. Goggles means well, but when he wants to help me, he leaps before he looks. But here, maybe this will help you out at least. Bright Bloom Seeds! I just sold a bunch of those, so I definitely needed them. Oh, and take this too. Um... The chasms are deep, so light from the surface doesn't make it down there. It's pitch black. But if you attach a Bright Bloom Seed to an arrow and shoot it, it'll light up the area. Definitely a useful trick down there. 
Okay, you'll want to head straight out of Lookout Landing's southern gate. You'll find the chasm goggles used just outside. I don't know too much about how your camera works, but I'm counting on you to bring me that picture. Oh, and please look after goggles for me. Sounds good. I think at this point, we are going to t Josh's profile's been added. We're gonna take a break. And, uh, once we get back, we will, uh, try to keep Robbie alive! <laughs> she gave us all her stock! Anyway, uh, we'll be right back. Stand up, stretch, do what you need to do. Uh, get some water, get some food, go to the bathroom. Just don't sit for too dang long. I beg you. We have returned, and we are still here. Before we move on, though, I got a special prize today. The, uh, this is the Tears of the Kingdom Amiibo, which I just picked up. And the audio's muted because I was playing a silly song during the break. A sunshroom. A bright cap. A knight's broadsword. I think that that would be a good one to augment with uh, with Amber. Ooh, or the uh, or the yeah the the uh, the dual Boca horn. Ooh, desperate strength effect, quick char, quick charge, extra durable. I didn't realize some of these had different effects. There we go, the Blue Boko Reaper. Desperate strength, I'm assuming, increases uh, attack power when uh, when health is low. All right, is this the, yeah, that's the, that's the chasm. Good thing I already had a travel point there. I wonder if like, uh, like, so I'm pretty sure like the, uh, the different Zelda ones have different effects, but all my amiibos are still packed up. Sorry, amiibo are still packed up. So I'd have to go digging for them. Is that the guy? No, it's a different guy. A caravan. What do you got, buddy? I do love the plains. Hi there, I welcome to the rolling pastures. It feels so good to be out in the plains. My friend seems to be enjoying it too. Huh, stop looking at me like that. It might seem like I'm alone, but my best friend is right here. See, my bestie's got four heads and a, uh, four heads, four legs and a pretty mane. Now about sampling, uh, how about sampling some Hateno, uh, some of Hateno Village's oh. finest? Uh, Hylian Tomato. Grab two of those. Oh! 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 I can't believe you're buying this from me! Whoa! Oh! Oh! Some of the stuff I bought here, I want to see if I can make an apple pie. I just need to find apples because I think I'm, I think I ran out when I gave my last one to that guy. I wonder if Robbie's okay. Whoa! Hey, what's the big D ID? You can't just walk up behind someone standing at the edge of a chasm. My colleague who works with me on the zone I survey team is down there. Well, what happened if I slipped and fell on him, huh? Huh? Don't startle me again. I'm deep in my investigation work at the moment. I'm gonna shove you in there. Oh boy. The depths. How far, did, how far did Robbie go? Ah. Are you Link? Pleasure to meet you. I'm Ponic from the Zonai Survey Team. Robbie told me to guide uh, you to him once you arrived, ah. but he rushed along with such haste that he didn't bring enough bright bloom seams that I've run out. So I lost sight of him. Help! 
I thought he was uh, taking a short walk over there with that glowing area. Then he just kept going. And going. Last I saw him, he was, he uh, he was heading way out there off to the west. Do you have any bright blue seams with you? I do. Oh, that's great news. Light the sur a light from the surface doesn't reach down here, as you might have noticed. You'd be risking your life to wander here without a light source, you know. You can easily get bright bloom seeds from caves. The uh, light up have struck, so it's pretty easy to use. We use the seeds all the time on the Zonai survey team. Sim uh, the simplest way is to throw them uh, with your hand. Ah. Oh. I uh, those of us skilled enough with a bow will attach them to arrows and fire them off in the distance down here. Oh. I didn't know you could just throw them. If you're going to explore the depths, take plenty of seeds with you. Oh, that's my way back up. Alright, well, uh... Ooh. Are these darters? Special ingredients for elixirs. A deep firefly, a multi-winged insect that lives in the depths. It excretes luminescent elements that can be cooked into an elixir, which will add a faint glow to anyone who consumes it. All right. Uh. How the heck do I throw this stuff again? So what do we have here? Uh, the Nisoy's light- Oh, wait! Is this un- this is under the, uh, under the, uh, what do you call it? The shrine, isn't it? Oh my god, we're in the realm of Sheagorath. What with the amber and whatnot. Oh, that's pleasant. And gave me a fast travel point down here, too. Oh lord! <laughs> The light route dispelled the darkness and brightened the surrounding area. Does that mean the entirety of Hyrule is... is down here? Hey, you! It's really dark down here. Not one bit of light gets from the surface. Even my goggles can hardly see. You should really bring some bright loot. The glowing roots, yada yada yada. Anyway, I'm off to see the glowing root! See the shot of the west from here! Better hurry, get a move on! And shortcut. Plenty. What was that? Was that the sound of the, the fireflies make when I collect them? So the shrines and the so it, basically, you could you could use the uh, the um, the overworld map as a way to explore the depths and try to find um, try to find shrines in order to light up the area. A muddle bud, wildflower that uh, with a powerful odor that can disorient and confuse makes it difficult to tell friend from foe. Interesting. What do you have to say, other note? Hey, you still alive? Looks like this place is warm and in gloom. Get too close to stuff, uh, and you're asking for trouble. If a guy didn't get any bright blooms, it'd be curtains. Then again, it's my first time down here, so I haven't kicked the bucket. And I haven't kicked the bu bucket, so I'm sure it'll be fine. Uh, I spotted some, uh, some interesting through my goggles. It's shaped like a figure Joshua wants us to find. I'm continuing, head, uh, to head west towards one of those glowing roots. So I, I see ahead. I'll see you, see you soon. Robbie.
Roberto! Bombs? Okay. No. How do I select it from this menu? You don't, you throw, you throw, what do you mean you throw first? Oh, I see. You charge a throw first. Some dark Boca boys. Oh no. Ooh. They're collecting Zonite down here. Oh no. Oh, don't do that! Lot to be doing here. Uh, did one of those guys have a... A thing attached to a rock? Uh, I thought that was maybe the guy that I shot down from up here, but I guess not. Rock hammer, there we go. Uh, it's hard to determine what to get rid of here. I, you know, I wanted to drop it, but... Ooh. Large Zonite. Give me that precious, precious metal. It is pretty calamitous. You know what I should do? I'm gonna throw... This away and I'm gonna just keep using the fan. The fan blade! Alright. Bright Bloom, go! Ooh, we got a nice mushroom here. Puff Shroom. A mushroom that sp uh, spreads a cloud of fine spores when stimulus is applied. The powder makes them inedible. inedible. Which means they're more used probably as like a, like a grenade substitute. There are so many fireflies in here. You would not believe your eyes if I stole the fireflies and there was no light ever to be had. I steal all the butterflies. I'm sorry, the fireflies. I'll leave that one to tell the rest. Oh, really? Well, that's about what I expected. Let's use the flame emitter club. Actually, let's just use a sword. They look like they have little mohawks.
How did I not hit you in the face after all that? Oh boy, they take away your uh, your stuff, huh? Plenty of gloom and doom with these fellers. Oh, for God's sake! Oh my God! No, jump away, you ding dong! Obnoxious. Whoops! Ah, oh, immediately. Like, do not pass go, do not collect $200. What a horrific area. I picked up my arm, but it didn't really do much for me. After all, I am headless now. Throw! Jeez, that thing is high up. That's all it took, huh? Uh, they were definitely mining down here. Uh, do I have- do I have another one of these? No. I chucked the other one away. I like how the- the main mode- the main mode of mining in this is attach rock to sword. But I guess with all of the weapons and equipment being kind of, you know, broken, we had to- we have to make do. Way down in Boko Bo. We're headed to Cabo. Uh, Ar Arrowcuda. And an Arrowcuda eyeball. Okay, they do fly away if you're not sneaking. Arrowcuda. Dundal London 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 Anna. Wee wee wee. I think I see another root off in the distance there, but it'd be easier if I do this. Ya I I uh I usus. I usus. Aya use this root. Aya use this root! Wow, that spread a lot further. The light dispelled the darkness and brightened the surrounding area. You... You made me worry, mister. Don't you... Hey. Hey, I see you rolling your eyes. Don't you roll your eyes at me, mister. What do you think? This is the thumbnail for the video? Ha. 
what? Look at how bright that thing got. That light uh, down in this darkness is downright refreshing. Hmm, in fact, it's so luminous, it's almost like, like we're on the surface. Just standing here makes me feel so much better. How strange. Hey, it's you, you're finally here. I need to show you what I found. This statue, it's standing tall on two legs, one arm raised high. Looks an awful lot like that figure Josh has shown us in this piece of slate, don't you think? All right, get that camera of yours ready and puts in some work. That's right, I forgot you hadn't used the, the camera when we last spoke. Very curious indeed, given it's one of the Parapad's basic features. Hmm, give me the Parapad for a second, all right? I see, it was locked behind child safety. Well, there's the problem. The camera is locked, and so is the Hyrule Compendium. Hang on. If I remember correctly, I press this and pull this, tap that, and then... I love the juxtaposition of the older people in this game, knowing exactly how the technology works. He's starting to sound like Doofenshmirtz. There you go. He's an American Doofenshmirtz! Creatures. Big and small. Boom! Now you should be able to use both the camera and your Hyrule Compendium. Go capture a picture of that statue. It's a good chance to verify that it's working properly, too. Test it out. Experience is the best teacher, after all. Once you've captured the image, come back here. I want to see how it looks. Hey, you! How'd that go? Capture an image of the statue with your camera, then hurry up and show it to me. I'd like to see how it looks. Eyes, 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 eyes. Whoa. So, did you get a good picture? That's a Nintendo Whoa. Switch, all right. Stupendous. Looks like you captured it well. I'm sure Josh will be satisfied with this. Lighting up that immense route, getting us the picture, uh, picture of the statue. You've just started helping us research what's down here, but soon enough, we're going to have even more to investigate. Well then, it's time to head back up to the surface. See ya, look out landing. Don't make Joshua wait for too long for that picture. Actually, I want to open up something here. Album. There we go. That's cool. It shows the images that Zelda took. And you can opt to delete them. I'm going to keep I'm going to try to keep them on, on there as, uh, as long as possible. I want to... <laughs> I'm going to... I hate myself for this one. 110 monsters, 92 creatures, uh, 126 materials. Okay, that's not bad. 175 weapons is not nearly as bad as I thought. And six different types of treasure. Oh, treasure chests, right. What I love about this is that it basically just tripled the size of Breath of the Wild's world. Breath of the Wild, there were, like, very little ca- Are those Tektites? <laughs> Ow! Well, at the very least, they're not corrupting me. So that's good. Uh, they didn't drop any kind of materials, though. They only dropped bright bloom seeds. Uh, since we're down here, I do want to get that uh, that other route that I can see from here. Yeah, that because that's not that's not that far. Okay, um, actually, while I'm thinking about it... A goblin horn! Start taking pictures of everything! A goblin arm! Uh... A goblin fang is not among there, but I think it's just because... Well, it might be on there. Let me see. Yeah, no. Bacoblin Fang is not part of that. 
So it seems like the only materials that the the thing is really knows at this point. Uh, Boko Horn, Boko Arm. All right. Uh, the only thing that the compendium is really gonna be looking for in this situation, in terms of materials, is what can be used to to modify a weapon. I can see several roots from here, actually. Oh, it's very tempting to just go on my own and do that. Hello? There's a bright blue glow over there. Oh, another Boca Boy. I think it's a Boca Boy. Oh no, it's a Peblet! Oh, what do we got here? I got Pose! We saw that statue that was looking for Pose. Is that what they're- they're called Peblets, right? I don't have anything else that can break that. Oh, wait, wait! Yeah, okay. Pound it. Bright bloom seed. Yeah. Boop. Almost ran straight into this thing. Another one of these statues. Could be a worthwhile venture for later. These guys are mining. Ooh. Oh, for goodness sake. There we go. Not my finest work. Oh, for, God dang it. I can't get up either. Good lord. Fortunately, these things are like all heads, so. Son of a bitch, I'm almost dead. A throwing spear? There we go. Whew. All right, I'm almost there. Let me see, what do I got now? Let's augment the... Even before that, let me get a picture of this stuff. I mean, listen, they are all head. You are not going to convince me otherwise. There we go. And it's still a sword, just with a ton of reach on it now. Oh, I should have taken a picture of the arrow. Whoa! I didn't realize you were still alive, my friend! Wow, that was very serendipitous. Uh, I need the rock hammer. I guess I'll drop the traveler spear. Might as well take pictures of these as well. Oh, okay. So if it's a few, if it's something fused together, then it'll only take a picture of the of uh, the base material for it. I didn't get a picture of it. Remind me to never delete Zelda's photos. Anything else around here? No. Okay. Should be careful. Oh, no way, I wanted the- it, yeah. I wanted the rock hammer, because I wanted to, uh, I wanted to, uh, uh, what do you call it? Uh, Bogart their mining facility here. 
Puff shroom. I imagine a good place to like consider making like mining equipment would be just uh, to head over to the Goron area, to um, Elden and uh, Death Mountain. Uh, did he drop arrows? He did. I remember for a while it was hard, one of the hardest things to get a picture of was uh, was arrows. It, at least in Breath of the Wild, naturally. Also, like, some of the lizards are really hard to get. Oh, I gotta get a picture of the enemies at some point, too. Which probably means the the, uh, the bokoblins that can- that are corrupted. Uh-oh. I lost where I was going. There it is. I can't- I couldn't- Oh, the ores! You're right! I should get a picture of the, uh, the- the full ores as well. I forgot about that. A lot of this is the same as Breath of the Wild, so... Yeah. Another one of those statues. Whew. Hopefully there aren't any more enemies around here, because I am... quite close to death here. Yeah. Okay, just a little area I need to climb up. There we go. I see more pose in the distance, but I can come back for those laters. The Nikhaim Light Route. Let's get this place lit up! And... Wa-bam! I wonder if these areas make like a grid. Alright. Ah, and I can just teleport out of here. Yeah, no, the- this-, this the area is practically tripled. That's insane. Uh, okay, actually, given the topography of this... So I already saw this- this shrine here. But, there's this one here, and then there's a shrine somewhere in this area. So I'm actually going to put a pin around this area, just so I know that it's there. Oh, this is so cool. What do pictures give you? Um, so at some point, I'm assuming if this is like Breath of the Wild, at some point I'll unlock a, uh, the, the, uh, radar ability. And, uh, what you can do, generally the radar ability points out where shrines are. But, um, if you get it upgrade, if you got it upgraded in Breath of the Wild, you could have it track things that you, uh, that you recorded in the compendium. Whoa, who are you, guy? Launchpad? He's a pelican. No, hold on. He's 100% a pelican. Now here's the thing, do I give him Launchpad's voice or do I give him a pelican voice? Oh. Well, look at this. You're the one I saw flying around the sky. It's great to meet the first one ever be launched from Skyview Tower. A real historic moment. Hey, what's your name? Mm. Link, you say? Hold on there. Really? Your name is Link? Hey, buddy. <laughs> You've got the same name as that famous swordsman. <laughs> Good for you. Pretty big name to live up to, though. Ah. I'm Penn, by the way. I work at the Lucky Clover Gazette. I'm writing an article about this event so, ev uh, so folks everywhere will know about the Skyview Towers being activated. I'd better get uh, get to work. Our newspaper is short on staff, so I had to flap all over the place to cover the news. Hey, we could use another reporter. You should join us. Seems uh, seem like a brave type and all. That's what it takes. Oh. Our newspaper is based in Hebra, to the northwest. You'll find it near the bridge that leads to Rito Village. Stop by if you're up uh, for the for the adventure of a lifetime in the, in the newspaper biz. Until then, soar long. Soar long. Pelican mouth! Perfect size to put news in to deliver. Inside, very secure and... what have you. News get there safely. Put news in Pelican mouth! Put news in Pelican mouth. Hey, you! 
Show Josha the picture you took of the statue. The figure matches it pretty well, and it, it looks darn cool, too. Hey! This is it! This does match what's on the fragment! Yeah. Thank you, swordsman! Just like on the slate, this figure must be showing people of some sort, whoever they were. Which confirms my theory that people lived in the depths. I'm sure we'll find more traces of them if we keep searching. This is a big, big, big discovery! Now what's next? Now what's next? The possibilities. There's so much to, more to research. Oh, but before I focus on that, there's something I want to give you as thanks for helping me in the stage of my investigation. Our early surveys of the depths found all of this. What do you think it's for? Zonite! I feel as if these contain, uh, some kind of strange power. Like, maybe it's energy for something. Anyway, they might help you search your Princess Zelda, so hopefully you'll find use them <laughs> useful. That fragment has helped us see the depths in a new way. Now we're closer to understanding one of its mysteries. I'm gonna sift through everything that our surveys have brought back from down there. Maybe there's even more fragments that I could piece together. Goggles! Swordsman! <laughs> thank you so much for going to, uh, to investigate the depths for me. Pearls. Who you who stand before me? I am the one who returns pearls to the afterlife where they belong. Offer pearls to me. They are spirits that ought to return to the afterlife. Here's a poe for you. Oh yes, this is indeed a poe. What pitiful beings these are. They have lost their way home and wander the depths of this land. I have returned the lost spirit to the afterlife where it belongs. Since I was brought here to the surface, I have been unable to return Poe's to the afterlife. Because of you, I can assist them again. You should take this. A dark clump. An unusual substance is cold to the touch and it seems uh, as though it's filled with pitch darkness. Use it in cooking to get a gloom resistant effect. If you offer me more, more Poe's, I will give you suitable compensation. Uh, 150 for the dark tunic. Well, we don't, I know what I'm saving up for. Tunic obtained by offering pose to a strange statue. It's a uh, spurious replica of the green outfit once worn by a legendary hero. My brethren, whose spirits reside in the statues far larger than mine or to the depths of this land. If you encounter my brethren, try offering pose to them. If you offer me ten bows, I will tell you the location of one of my brethren. Maybe another time. Farewell. Yeah, this is very similar to Kilton. Uh, I'm gonna take a- I'm gonna- I'm gonna take a- I'm gonna have Link take a nap. I'm not gonna take a nap, but Link is. I did want to see if I could make apple pie, but I don't want to lose my hearts by burning myself while cooking, so I'm gonna go ahead and sleep. Let me try the bed next to this guy. Cause I wonder if like, if there, if um, cause uh, the guy in the center bed who was there before said, try going to a different bed, otherwise he'll be ha 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 ha. Ah! The blood moons rise. When its red glow shines upon the land. The endless spirits of slain monsters return to flesh. Just as they did in a war long past. The world That's a big boy. Once again. That man's head is a sword. Either Zelda's been infused with her past lives, or... Oh god, there's gloom here. Either Zelda's been infused with her past lives, or, uh... I lost my train of thought. Or, or like, she's lived several lifetimes after being kidnapped. Or after being, uh, teleported into the light. Cause she's significantly less, like, worried and more stoic. Alright. I wouldn't mind trying to get another heart container. Or more, uh, more stamina. Uh, I kinda want my travels to take me further to the south, cause I wanna- I mean, come on. Pirates. 
Pie? Well, here's the problem. I don't have any wheat. I feel like I probably need wheat to make apple pie. So, I th so what? So we're gonna take off to the south and, and collect some of these uh, some of these um, uh, um, who's a what's along the way. If I can get some wheat, then I'll then I'll do that. It's a raid from Lucagen. Well, excuse me, princess. Let's get them countermeasures a going. I love my wing shield. It's lasted a long time too. I wasn't expecting that. Well, you can't see it right now because my big ugly mug is blocking it. What have you done? Luke and Jin, thank you for the raid. How was your stream? What were you playing? And what have you done? I'm a variety streamer here on Twitch playing Tears of the Kingdom. Aha, so I was right. There was one over there. Oh, you're watching the Zelda cartoon. Good way to celebrate this. Watching the Zelda cartoon with Tim. Ah. Oh, right. I forgot. Emil and Tim are visiting, uh, are visiting uh, John and Reese in Canada for Odafest. Oh, you know what? Is this... There should be... Well, here's the thing. I haven't, I haven't even found a... If I, once I find a stable, then I'll actively look for a horse. But I have yet to find a stable, so I'm not going to look for a horse right now. Should go to that tower next. Class, such a classic line. Well, excuse me, princess. What the heck is this? A banner of some kind. Whoops. Ignore me! Give me thine horns! All right, let me, uh, photo, t photo up! A Boko shield. Thick stick! All right, uh, bam, 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 bam. It's a Boko shield. All right, uh... Let me drop all of my shields, so that way I can get pictures of them. Because I'm going to get rid of that flame emitter shield. Am I okay? Yeah, we got a- th of course I'm okay, we got a thick stick! The only, the logical solution, the uh, logical next step here is to, uh, is to, uh, make the, the thicker stick. Um, I guess I'll keep what I got, though. The Flame Emitter Club hasn't been very useful, so I'm gonna go ahead and drop that. Although, that's both my Flame Emitters. I'll drop the thick stick and take the flame emitter club. Uh, I guess I'll I'll have the rusty broadsword sword. The rusty sword broadsword. Tough thing to say. All right, our travels are eventually going to take us south into into the uh, Nekluda region, where I might find the uh, I forgot what the village was called. Oh! That worked out in my favor. You and your thick stick. All right, then we'll call it a draw. Right, then we'll call it a draw. I'm so glad arrows are much more plentiful here. 
Uh, that's just the thick stick. But it would make mining easier, so I'll get rid of my rock hammer in exchange for this rock hammer. Uh, I think my broadsword broke. If that's the case, I do want to imbue it with the power. Uh, where are my materials? There we are. Uh, amber is quite plentiful here. Uh, we got, you know, we got so much of this and I think it does more damage than amber. Yeah, it does the same amount as amber, but it, this is probably more durable though. Uh, we'll go ahead and drop this. Uh, got that. I'm gonna be whistling so much because that's just what I do. Bam! All right, there's the shrine. Anything else around here? I don't see it. Can we make meat arrows? Yes! They might have a purpose for attracting predators, but... I'm gonna wait until we get into a battle before I decide to make a meat arrow. Huh. No, you can't attach cooked meals to, to, uh, to weapons. I would love it if you could make, like, the, um, the mistakes. And they deal, like, poison damage or something. Confuse the enemies. A spinning device. Dang. I should get off of here. Dang. What if I could stop it? What are the power wheels? Five arrows, good, good. That's all the chests in here as well. The second I'm able to make something that has turning functionality, game over. Monado! Oh wait, hold on. Oh, I see what they want me to do. Well, it's a good thing they gave me more of these. What a roundabout way to turn this thing around. No, come back! Okay, hold on. Uh, okay, I've got an idea. It's- Oh god, it attached to the chest! It actually worked out in my favor, now that I think about it. I have a car! Alright, I might need this again, because it looks like I've got a- Figured that would be the case. All right. OK, 
Can I attach the bottom of the wheel to this? No, that okay, that makes it so it falls off immediately. Uh Okay. I tend to make these a lot more difficult than they need to be. Cuz I think what I need to do is like attach here and then yeah, there we go. Time keeps on spinning, spinning, spinning into the future. I want to fly like an eagle to the sea. Fly like an eagle, let my spirit carry me. See, we could do it the way the game wants us to do it, but I could also do this. Goodbye, wheels. Damn it. Come. No, 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 no. Yeah, that actually works out significantly better than I thought it would. Because if I'm right... Nope. There we go. Yeah! Why must you interrupt us during intimate time? I was just about to bang my hot wife. Tony Wonk! Oh my god. Yep. Tony Locks Pro Shielder. I think we have a raid message. Now, if only, if only we could attach wheels to the shield. Oh man, I really don't want to get rid of this glider shield. It served me well. This is like, this is probably my, like, everybody's gotta, like, everybody who's playing this game, just because of all the combinations and whatnot, are gonna have a signature look. The wing shield? That's my signature look. Oh, it's so good. We can get that, and then we can get that tower, then we can keep heading further uh, southeast. It represents my free spirit. You're trying to hit me with a mushroom club? I'll kill you. Spike Boko Shield. Definitely should pick that up because it's stronger than what I've got. And Blue Boko Horn. Ten. Wow. Is that a... Oh, this is gonna hurt. Can I take a picture of the mushroom? I can. Bouncy bat. I wonder if it has increased knockback. Oh, he saw me. Not today, mister! Ah! 
Okay, today. Today. Today is the greatest day I've ever known. Can I eat bomb flowers? No. Goodness, I was afraid I wasn't gonna kill him in time. Wait. Blue moblin horn. I don't think I got the regular moblin horns. Either way, that's probably pretty dang good. Already got this. Delete that. Moblin fang. The blue. 13! Jeez, um. You're gonna put on something durable. The Boko Boy. Oh, he held on to it. Oh, he killed me! Man! Great. You're not helping! Now I've got to take pictures of these again. Oh. Gruff Mal with the 50 months tier one saying, Happy Zelda Dave Tom, I hope you're enjoying the game. I know I am. I've been having a great time with it so far. You can fuse crates to weapons, yes. Alright, uh... Drop. Get that Boko shield. I picked up the shield I just dropped. I should probably eat. Oh boy, oh boy, uh... Oh no, come on. Where? F fruit, fire. Oh god, come on, baby, light my fire! I missed! Found the shrine. That didn't do as much as I hoped it would. Let's curse you and your kicks! My wing shield! You will pay. Oh shoot, I didn't get a picture of that yet. Whatever. Oh, and a wing and a prayer. Alright, um... Let me get the other guy.
Sheena. I don't need the rock hammer right now. All right, uh, where is that shrine? Can you drop it and take a pick? I suppose so. I gotta go into the menu, and it's just a whole thing. What are you? You're something I can glue to a weapon. Can I take a picture of it? No. I'm gonna attach it to the zone I sword. Oh my god. <laughs> A stake. I see what they wanted me to do with that. In which case, I have made a horrible mistake. The steak is special. Whoops! As you can attach it to the wall. Bring this down. Attach. Hopefully that's enough. No, it's not. All right, uh... First off, this needs to come up and much further in. There we go. Locked into place! They kind of show it, so they kind of show it like in the, in the wall there. Which kind of gave me the idea of being able to attach platforms to it. Large Zonite Charge! There was a brief moment where I was like, wait a minute, where's the shrine? Vampires are inside! Vampires. After the shrine, we'll take a break. Interesting. We are going to make use of that immediately. So you're supposed to learn about stakes in here. So what does it want me to do? There's a target there. <laughs> Ow! Take the stairs this time. What is this? I need to create something to launch this ball, it looks like. I doubt I could just be like... Yeah, it's too far away. Oh, but I did attach it to, to the stake. What is this? Pillars, rolls. We've got this thing. 
It seems like I need to make something that like rotates, that like flips. But until I figure out what this thing is, I'm not gonna be able to do that. Ah, okay. Have our we have our answer. So It's a baseball game. It's a baseball pitching machine. Hold on, I actually need to uh, stake that into the ground. Don't attach it. Oh, these stakes are going to end up being the best and worst thing ever. All right. Da 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 da! -da! Charge! Huh. Not with that, though. In fact, it, I did it again. Okay. I gotta stop doing that. All right, so the issue is that the bat is weak. Oh, I can't. I was... Well, there's a reason it gave us this, right? Let's try it. This thing just has to go first. There we go! That's strong enough. But, I just need the angle right. There we go! Um... There is, however, the bonus. Okay, hold on. Let it go. Grab. Up. There we go. Oh, what do you mean I can't rotate it anymore? Hmm. Steak is getting in the way, that's for sure. Uh... Ah, okay, I'm, I'm doing this the wrong way. Like that. 
Let me take this steak off of there too. I like the, the I like the steaks. They're very neat. It's just they are very complex. Okay. So instead of folding it up that way, I should fold it up. There we go. Hold that in place. There we go. Get this out of here. Okay. Now swing late. Bang. There we go. Treasure acquired. Energizing elixir. Lest I forget to take pictures of everything. <laughs> now die so we can do it again. That was a fun one. I like these challenges. Making me think outside the box here. I do miss the more physics based ones because those ones were easily broken. Again, you come into my shrine, as I'm about to bed my wife, and you think not of our love, but only of yourself. Take our blessing. It's just a baseball I kept in the drawer near the bed. Don't ask why. That was so clean you can almost forget that you walked off the edge twice. Almost. I see Buc I see I see Bacoblins. I was like, hey, is that something I can uh Is that a uh, is that a, a a Hylian settlement? Nope. Yump. Yump. Alright. Uh is there a part of this that's open? It's it's one way, isn't it? Oh yeah, I was gonna go on a break after I got to the shrine. But there's also the promise of new map. Hi there! Think you can take me? Don't forget me! The second I step up there, I'm probably gonna die. Can I even climb up? Is there, is there a way for me to climb up there? Is that climbable? Okay, hold on. Uh, climb- oh! Okay. Oh! Are they gonna activate that in some way? Probably not, although I do see a quick and easy solution to my problems. There we go. Wow, you're still alive! That one's wearing armor. <laughs> oh 
Oh god. Uh no, my spike Boko shield. I could wait until he uh, until he loses all the. Ooh, he's got armor, huh? Armor over here. Well, I got an idea then. If that's the case. I just need a good bit of distance from him, is all. That took care of his armor. Ooh, I better get a picture of that before it, uh, before it... Sturdy, thick, stick! This orc was made for fighting. Oh, it's a big boy! Ooh, that's the biggest boy! Wow, that's the biggest boy! Oh boy. Where's he going? Oh, he's not weak like those other ones are. Whoa, he's fast! Okay. Oh no! I gotta go all the way around again. Ugh. Maybe we'll take that break sooner than I anticipated. Ah! Oi! Oh, thank goodness. Oh yeah, I might be able to light the stakes on fire. Uh, let's see. No. Ah! Definitely climb around to get up there. They treated it somehow with some sort of flame, flame retardant chemical. Upsidoodle. Upsidoodle. Okay. Careful. Stand up, Link. Come on, you're embarrassing yourself. Ah! Okay. I there we go. I was gonna say I got up here before. All right. There's the biggest boy. Ah. Okay. I see my ticket. Ow. 
Ray. Die, why don't you? Apples to replace all the apples I wasted. Uh, is that worth taking a picture of? No. Boko guts. I no longer have a shield. Okay, lot. Oh, the club left, but we have the attachment, so it's fine. Uh, blue boss boko horn. I can turn sticks into axes. Kick axe! 16! Better find something durable to use that with. I'm gonna eat their steak. Bingo! <sighs> Well, Pierce 100 bits saying unsolicited advice. Lord Chaos Nightmare VT with 100 bits saying war. War never changes. In the years after Ga Calamity began his defeat, uh, weapons began to decay. So one scientist made a weapon that wouldn't decay, but in her lust for perfection destroyed the world she meant to protect. And Wing Dings Gaster 66 with the Prime Sub. Or the Tier 1 Sub, actually. Thank you. I thought I saw something I could pick up. The best way to see if there's stuff you could pick up is to, is to activate this. Because there is a boko Oops. horn down here. Alright. I like the idea that they built this and then, and then like, just left it alone long enough that the bokoblins came in to, to, uh, to just take over. Oh! Oh! Someone in chat made an excellent point! Wait! Uh... Oh! I have a mace! That's what the big guy was using! Link looks at where it plugged in the data, it's like, of course, I can't use the, the stand on the Pyropad when it's charging. Nice going, Pure Tendo. I like the winch. The winch with like all the cable, it's really cool. Surface map updated. 45 degree, oh we're up in the sky, that's why. Sky map updated. Hey, we can actually hit some of these sky islands. We'll get up there and we'll take a break. Also, something to, to note with everything that's like, that seems seemingly in this game, a golden apple. A rare, very sweet fruit that has an extra sparkle to it, sometimes found near normal apples. Oh, for goodness sake, how did I miss that? There we go. A 
Sundalion. Sorry, I know we said we'd take a break, but I'm just like so invested. Wow, there are a ton of golden apples on here. That I should take pictures of. Fifty more weeks with duck bug. No sleep till Brooklyn. All right, we got some ruins down there we could check out. So, yeah, we'll take a quick break and then we'll head down over there. Go to the bathroom, get food, get drinks, stretch, whatever you need to do. We will be right back. All right. It's been several hours since I took my break, as you can see by getting nighttime. Uh, let's head on over here. We have this sky island. This skyland, as it were. Can't break open egg. I would like to break open Fabergé egg, but I can't break open Fabergé egg. Fair? Wait, did I find a fairy fountain? Fairies. Fairies! I, Mr. Crocker, will collect the fairies! And now I've got defense against dying! Uh, oh man, we got a raid from the Steven George. Bingo! From the SS Nut. Trying to get this fairy. Let's get them countermeasures going. Come, come down, little fairy. What have you done? I lost the ferry. Uh, welcome, everybody from uh, Steven's crew. My name is Tom Fox, variety streamer here on Twitch, playing, as many people are these days. Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom, I am loving it. And I, Mr. Crocker, will be out here collecting fairies! Fairy godparents! Ooh, there's a, I'm in a sky island right now. Uh, I got a mace. That's pretty cool. I kind of want to get this fish. Hopefully it stay, it'll stay long enough for me to just casually walk up to it and take it. Is it gone? No, it just went deep into the water. Dang it. Uh, Nanocarb Zero, I think, for the Prime Sub. Thank you, thank you, thank you. There is a glider path here. Well, let's see. These glider paths usually lead somewhere else you could probably easily get to. I don't think I'm getting anywhere else, though, because I don't have the ability to jump up anywhere. Except, well, not jump in, like, a horizontal fashion, but jump in various other places. At any rate, uh, right now... We're in the sky right now, but we plan on making it back to the surface and heading somewhere around here to get to a, uh, a coastal city. My reasoning for this is because there is a, uh... Let me see. There is a village that Give was in Tears cash. of the Kingdom that was a fishing village. And, uh, it has apparently been overrun by pirates. So that is our current goal right now. Let's just go ahead and, uh... We Let me see. Anything of note? Uh... Wait, Southwest. In Breath of the Wild, yes. In Breath of the Wild, there was a, uh, there was a village. What did I say? 
I tend to do that a lot. Oh, it's the Great Plateau! I'd rather go up here, because I want to see if there's a, uh... I don't know if there's a tower up here. But I definitely want to see if there is somewhere to teleport throughout here. Plenty of gloom throughout, uh, throughout the Great Plateau. I need to reach my friend! Ah, uh, my friend and I got separated. Well, that's far. My friend is sending up a smoke signal. I can't wait to catch up. I'm so tired though, I can't move. <laughs> what? No. <gasps> There's a steering mechanism. We found our steering mechanism, I just don't have any wheels. So we're taking them the long way. Hunter Miss from Will Pierce saying, speaking of fairies, that live action series failed so hard, it took off, uh, I took it off, I got, it got took off the service and a pitch bible for another reboot was leaked along with test animation. It's going for a stylized low frame CGI. It's referring to Fairly Odd Parents. Oh. And Murmur, thank you for the 500 bits. All right, hold on. I gotta. Here. You, you stay put. I need to figure out where your smoke signal is. Every time I've got to stop and look for something, I'm going to attach another one of these to, to it. You can't use these for combat like you could in the past. Jesus! Oh, he's got armor too to spare. I was afraid that was going to happen. There we go! Holy cow, that did a lot of damage! Oh, the herbs heal full. Heal one full heart each. Oh, you don't need that. Out of God, not again. Ah, hmm, ah, oh. And that killed it immediately, thank goodness. Camera time. Dragon- Dragon Bone Boke? I don't think I'm supposed to be here yet. There is some powerful stuff on here. However, there is also- Yes, yes, I know you need to see your friend. Yes! I was wondering if this is gonna be a trident. And it was. The Black Bacoblin Horn. And do I already have a picture of the thick club? Yeah, thick, thirty, uh, thick, sturdy stick. All right, we had to take a break, so now I have to do it. Oh, for goodness! No!
All right, all right. We'll get you to your buddy, but first, there's something I gotta do. Hopefully by the end of this, we'll reach the upper limits of what we can attach stuff to. You get the camera yet? Yes! Those herbs are very useful. Anytime I see a Hyrule herb, we're gonna go for it. Jesus Christ, where is the smoke signal again? I have lost the smoke signal. Was it further up this way? I see more black bacoblins, which terrifies me. Oh wait, I think I, I think I saw it for a split second. Yes, it is up to the temple. I think it's actually where uh, where the old man was. All right, up we go. I need to reach my friend. La 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 la. Well, this was a big mistake. This is a big mistake, steak, 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 steak. Mada! Anything in this area? Ooh, I see something I can attach to. I think there's something that wants to kill me right now. But, oh, there it is. Is it two? Oh boy! Erokuda! Jung jigga 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 jung It's yeah. There's some guy carrying a giant boulder that's screaming. I don't know what's going on here exactly. It's just every now and again the boulder just starts screaming and I don't know why. Help! Well, Piers Lenderman sings, How are you enjoying uh, Legend of Zelda Nuts and Bolts? Enjoying it immensely. Push it to the limit. Oh, did I hit the. I think I hit the upper limit of things I can attach to one thing. Walk along! No, nope, never mind. It's just those rocks were underground, so they weren't going to attach. Walk along a razor's edge. Get him up there to the top. And that's a rest my friend! Push it to the limit. There's my friend! Thanks for bringing my friends, there's something for you! Yeah. Bye! And all the stuff I brought- oh no, there it is! <laughs> See some mushy rooms. This is near where Breath of the Wild started, but it's not exactly where Breath of the Wild started. That is what I'm trying to get to. Hello. Oh wait, can I take pictures of the rupees? No.
Walk along a razor's edge. Oh, I should have taken a picture of that armoranth. Whatever, whatever I don't take pictures of, I should. Uh, I'll, uh, I'll drop it and take pictures of it later. Blue nightshade. Deadly, but good for being silent. Increases your stealth. My tail lizard. I've not taken a picture of the bright, uh, bright bloom seeds, though. Or the high tail lizard, which I probably should have taken a picture of. Ooh, a sticky lizard. He was a sticky skink. He was a sticky skink. Yeah, it's only been a couple years, but time has not been kind to this area. Can you take a picture of that? Yeah, bubble frog. Hit it once, hit it twice, hit it thrice, and roll the dice. A bubble gem. The shrine? Interesting. What happened to all the Sheik attack? This, I'm pretty sure, is where we started. <gasps> Uh-oh. I do believe I may have found a, uh, a Yiga encampment. Oh, banana. Danger. Zone I charge. Good. Yep, I'm gonna have to fight it. Oh, yep, there's a banana. Mighty banana. Hmm, it appears to be on a board. Clearly, it is not a trap. Danger. Okay. <laughs> the noble swordsman scrounging for scraps. You fell for the oldest trick in the book. You stumbled into our secret door store hell house for treasures from the depths. And now that you've seen it, I can't let you live. Your life ends today! That's not how you avoid that. <laughs> ah! I should eat! Golden apples are a store, one and a half hearts. Mighty banana. Uh, and also a picture of an eightfold blade. Interesting. Can't care anymore. Uh, should I drop something? Everything I have is good, though, is the problem. It's it'll be fine. Oh, do I have access to the storehouse now? Oh, uh, robot, 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 robot. Authorizer verified. I am a giraffe. Thank you for driving away the intruders. Those interlopers carried me here from with them from the depths. I have no way of returning to where I was stationed there. I will therefore continue my work here. My task in the depths was to manage, was to manage, manage, manage schema stones. A great deal of zonite was mined and processed there once. I have something for you, but I do not think you are ready to receive it. 
Please visit the great abandoned central mine in the depths and return here later. Ooh. Uh. I'll leave a treasure pin here, then. I consistently forget to unrobot. Yes, if I know me, I'm breaking the monotony, but Jesus, when it rains, how it pours. Up through the lines of the thick Venetian blinds, it collars shooting off of the curve. Hey! Just when you think you're in control, just when you think you got a hold, just when you get on a roll. Ah, oh, here it goes, here it goes, here it goes again. Ah, oh, here it goes again. I shoulda known, shoulda known, shoulda known again. But here it goes again. Ah, oh, here it goes! Ah, oh, here it goes! That is interesting to me, though. Okay, let me get up there, then crouch, then walk over to the lizard. Never mind, the lizard heard me and proceeded to flee. There's gotta be something up here. Cause getting back up here would be a pain in the butt if there wasn't some way to teleport back up. Let's check the Temple of Time. Try to grab as much foodstuffs as I can as well. Ah, yes! My glued together monstrosity. <laughs> Link's gotten stronger. I remember how much of a hassle it was to push some of these boulders. There's also one further up. Can I? I don't have to jump to it. I could just take it. I could reach out and 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 take take it. There we go. Just reach out, reach out, grab the the apple. Take take the apple. I see a squirrel. They only drop acorns. Oh. I need uh, a slicey. This is a forest doctor rock. So a Deku scrub. Oh, I should have taken a picture of that. Octo balloon. Gonna try and take a picture of. I should take a picture of the peppers as well. There we go. High tail lizard. Getting the, uh, I, I don't know, like, the, getting the equivalent of the Sheikah armor in this would be nice. If there were such a thing. I wouldn't mind if, Deku, if the Deku Scrubs came back. I mean, I'd love it if the Deku... I, I say I wouldn't mind, but in reality, I'd love it if the Deku Scrubs came back. Whoa! Please tell me, is, do you have a name, or is your, are you just trout... Grilled Bananas here! Mm. Travel... Yeah, there we go. Right up and buy a pair. Grill one up for me! Wait, what? Roasted Mighty Banana. <laughs> All right, then I hope you come back for the there we go beg the bananas for oh my god They're getting they're getting better you have to admit it they are getting better
Another eightfold blade. Anything I can take a picture of here? If they're a traveler, they're probably gonna try and kill you. Th I have to admit, that got me. That, like... The, the fact that he was selling roasted bananas was like, oh, he's definitely Yiga. But then when it actually opened up a shop menu? That's where I was tricked. Temple of Time Ruins. The Hyrule Edition. Another Aracuda. Uh, hey, I can get a blessing from the goddess Hylia. This is like the big one, too. They sold regular bananas before? I didn't know that. That never popped up for me. I am trapped under the water behind the stone gate of the Great Plateau. Huh. So nothing doing there. Uh... Stone Gate behind the Great Plateau. I'd have to probably do a little- uh, a couple of laps around here to try to find it. Oh, dollars to donuts, it might be in there. Is there really no way to port back up here? My Boko Reaper broke. Uh, I'll use the other Boko Reaper. I haven't seen any... Uh, any shrines around here. If there was just one, then I'd, then I'd be satisfied. Oh, I can go pick up the Eightfold Blade, you're right. I don't know. Anybody who's explored this entire area, do you know if there's any, uh, any shrines up here? I just want a yes or no answer. I don't want to know exactly where. There are shrines here. Okay. Probably easier to see at night as well. Now, is the Eightfold Blade still the- I think it's gone. Yep, it's gone. I went too far. Uh... Gotta try to get to a high up area so I can get a better view of uh, view around. Ooh. What do we got? Tree branch. More Aracudas. Is it Aracuda with a treasure chest? Uh, I already activated that. That's need to be activated. Hey, checking on top of the mountain might not be a bad idea, you dig? Oh boy, you're our a Ooh! I see Farosh! Oh god, oh god, uh oh, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. We're running out of arrows. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Uh no 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 no. None of that. Uh, picture taking time. Whew. 
Black Moblin Horn, a hefty horn with multiple tough barbs. 24! Good lord, I'm gonna be able to infuse my, uh, my stuff with, like, so much stuff. We saw one dragon in the distance, though. I don't know if that was one of the, uh, the Trinity. Seems like we can get, uh, we can get, um... Materials again, though. Okay, what is your deal, my friend? The fang, the horn, the claw, the scale would probably help augment shields. Oh boy, it's going down river! There it is. Shoot! No, 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 I just climbed all the way up here! I'm not going for it. My time is better served looking for the, uh, the shrine. They're going after a chest that I can't get in there. That was a chest, yeah. Can you even get out of there? Well, good luck, buddy. I think I got a really neat picture of it, though. Uh, an ice keys eyeball. Ice keys. If... Is that one? Is that on the Great Plateau? It's hard to tell. I it's it's really hard to tell. I don't I don't think it is, honestly. Ooh, ooh, we got a green flash. In uh in real life, uh, a green flash is when the uh, the sun is setting. And the sun and the horizon meet in such a way where the sky, the, where like the area where the sun is setting looks green for a second. It's really neat. Check with Pin, you know what, you're right. I should, God, those dragons are always so cool. I can't tell if it's further off than that though. Let's see, that is 100% not on the Great Plateau. I think the easiest way to pinpoint shrines is for me to go back down to the depths, right? Because you can see the roots for there and the roots line up for it. These Aracudas look like they're going to drop stuff on me. How'd I miss? Oh my god, where did you guys come from? Jesus Christ! Gives you a better vantage point than being on top of a mountain. Oh god! I think I just heard Narakuda. What? Whoa! A royal claymore. Much better than stick. Oh no, there are Koroks that you get for picking up rocks. Uh, 
So this is like at the back of the Great Plateau. I see- okay, so there's a- there's darkness over there. I see something over there, but I can't tell if that's on or off it. <gasps> there's a road there, so there's no way that's on. Yeah, that's off. Alright, let's check the depths. The depths below. Hey, pose. Thank you, fairies! <laughs> Where the hell are my... There we go. These are new. There are fans here. Oh, they are attached to that platform. Okay. I probably shouldn't be using this claymore. This is a very unique portion of the depths. Should probably turn that off to conserve battery. Oh, you know what? This is probably that mine. That a motherfucking rocket? Oh no! Ground control to Major Tom. I fear this may have been a mistake. Where am I? What's happening? I was still in the minecart. Oh, that went so far down. The Hylia Cannon, uh, Canyon Mine. Pose, considering their currency, Pose are probably, uh, uh, renewable. The indication here is that the parts of the Great Plateau are not connected to... Uh, that's a sconce, and that's also a lot of baddies. Oh, what even is this? I should be taking pictures of all this stuff. I can't take pictures of this stuff. What even is this? Is there a minecart around here I could use? No! I don't even- there's- there- oh, there's a root! It's really high up, though. Uh, let's see, maybe there's something down this end. I can't stop. Where am I?
Not where I want to be, that's for certain. The ground here is entirely covered. Oh no, it's not. Still, though, not... I find a lot of good places to be. However... Okay. This is putting me somewhere, because I see a root. The important thing is the root. Oh, get over it, Bennett Foddy. Question is, can I get to the root? The short answer is yes. The long answer is, oh boy. The long answer is, oh no. Oh no! Bingo! Die, die, die! Oh, Jesus! There we go. Whew. Getting better. Getting better. Okay, 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 okay. Um, ooh, 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 yes. Take a picture of the Zona I deposit. I think there's another enemy back there. Yep. He's just kind of farting around. Rock hammer! Hi there. You look like the kind of gentleman who should, you know, die. But even darkness can glow. At least in at least in Legend of Zelda. Oh, I'm on fire! Uh oh. Now here's where the problems begin. I lost the root. There it is. Oh man, it's up there. Let me try getting to a higher ground. There it is. Man, can I get up there? It doesn't seem feasible. No ground to clamber onto over there. What do we have here? <laughs> Traveler's sword sparkle. I'm just referring to that as that from now on. I think it's a pristine traveler sword! Interesting! So that's where you get the good weapons. Exploring this place is awesome, but wholly terrifying. 
I can't find any more roots down here. On top of that, I don't know where anything else is. Yeah. The light doesn't extend very far. My goal is really high up. It might be impossible for me to get to, to be honest. And I don't see any other routes aside from that one up there. I'm, I'm basically just in a pit. Oh, sod off. I don't know where I am. Really hitting me with a rock counted. Yeah. Running out of glow seeds as well. How does one leave? I could teleport out of here any time. But I really want that root. Oh, that's just the wall. God, that looked so horrifying. There it is! Let's see. Ah! And once I get to it on the overworld, I can just place a marker and I'll be able to find it. Holy cow! I thought this place was going to be almost entirely flat. Wow, was I wrong! Yeah. Was a canyon mine? They are. You're. You're not wrong. Corridat Light Root. That gives- that puts a little bit of light on the subject. The downside, though... Where am I in comparison? I'm still on the Great Plateau. Here's the problem, though. I have to find another exit that's in one of these, uh, in one of these chasms in order to make it there. Fortunately, there seems to be one close by to the southeast. Oh wait, can you only leave here by teleporting? No, there- some of these areas have hot air balloons, right? Oh boy, I guess I'm gonna fight out the hard way. But all, the problem is only some of the areas have hot air balloons. How can we help? Can't teleport to them? I can teleport to them underground. I can't teleport to the to the chasm entrances. Let me see. This particular exit I'm trying to get to might have a hot air balloon. But, it is very high up, and surrounded with gloom. Oh my god, that's- no, I doubt you could- no, you can't dive through the- I doubt you'd be able to do that. Can you dive through the root? If that's the case, then that made finding shrines super easy. Like, that seems way too easy. There's no way. I will be... There's no way this is gonna work. 
Okay. That just put me higher on the route. Okay. Which actually isn't a terrible thing, because it gives me a, a higher vantage point. Oh. It's all about micro-adjustments. Believe it or not, this does help. Okay, I think this is about as high as I'm gonna be able to get. Southeast. Iskabur, thank you for the uh, four months of tier one. I'm never gonna make this. Alright, let's climb it slowly. Oh my god, I'm gonna make it. God! Oh no! Oh my god, no! Oh, Jesus! Oh, one of them jumped up the cliff! I haven't even seen Lizalfos yet! Are they- how many of them are archers? Through it. Son of a bitch. There's a bacoblin up there, too. Down. Two down. <sighs> Was all horde? I probably should have taken a photo of that. Lizal bow. You know you're all alone, right? <laughs> Jesus Christ. I'm gonna be able to afford that black tunic very quickly. I did not see a possible escape for me there, which is why I fought. Arrows, thank God. Uh, damn it, I wanted those peppers. I was eating those beans. Yep, I won, but for how long? I think I may just have to pour it out of here somewhere else and come back for it later. Oh, the little- I have no idea what these little things are. I thought they were tektites at first. They're not, um... They're not corrupted by the depths. By the gloom. Which to me would think that they would warrant research, but... 
How close am I? I passed it. It's back to the west and slightly south. That's high. That is very high. Oh golly, that's high. That's very high. Oh! All I wanted to do was have adventures with pirates! And look where I am now! Just a fun, sexy pirate adventure. I almost ran into the gloom. Which, spoilers, probably would have killed me. Oh, I think I found a glider. Glider shield! It's south. You just hear it in Link's voice. Do you hear how upset the man is? Whew. Yep, there's the entrance. If there is a hot air balloon up there, then we're good. If not... Then we just gotta pour it out of here and come back some other time. Plenty of stuff here for getting around. But... No apparent way out. Uh... Alright. Unless the exit's further up, but it looks like it comes down right here. Something up there, but... Alright, let's pour it out of here. Which unfortunately is very far away. Ugh. Rocket glider? Let's give the rocket glider a shot. Are there rockets there? Yes, there are. Oh boy. Is there a steering column? There is not. What are these? There is a steering col- Oh my god, there's a steering column. Okay, hold on. Oh no. Oh no. Okay. I don't quite know what these are. But I'm going to attach a fan to one of them. Alright. Now for some speed. Please don't activate yet. I beg you not to activate yet. Because I still need to attach the steering column. Because hey, here's something fun. I don't know if, uh, if this is even gonna work. I've built a rocket plane that's probably gonna get me killed. I can't gain height with this. The fan's not powerful enough to give me height, it's just giving me more distance. <laughs> yep, I died. 
which is a good sign to get out of here. Wow, that's the closest place I've got? Good lord. Well, no, actually, that works out, because then I could, uh, I can go back over the Great Plateau. The rockets go very quickly. I just re realized whenever a blood moon happens. What the hell? Okay, hold on. That's my destination over there. I doubt I'm gonna- well, actually... I could make it to that mountain of the Sky Archipelago. Also, I didn't notice this before. These Nazca-ass lines. The question is, will I make it? And the answer may surprise you. Yes! Ooh, I can actually get up to the- no, I can't get up to the higher one, unfortunately. What are you firing at me? What the heck was that? That didn't sound like fire. Oh no. Okay, I figured out how to get up there. I don't like it, but I figured it out. And I think it's gonna be a long, long time Till touchdown brings me round again to find I'm not the man they think I am at home Oh no, no, no I'm a rocket man Rocket man burning out his fuse out there alone I can't bring it that high up And I think it's gonna be a long, long time Till touchdown brings me round again to find I'm not the man they think I am at home. Oh, no, no, no. I'm a rocket man. Mars ain't the kind of place to raise your kids. In fact, it's cold as hell. And there's no one there to raise them. If you did! I miss the Earth so much, I miss my wife. It is lonely out in space. You're new. I'm gonna- oh! Bingo! Uh, who was that? Megamorpha, thank you for the- Oh wait, I saw- I see a construct bow in there. Oh, that's mine! That's the one I'm wearing! I, lo I love filling the Hyrule Companion with pictures of Link. Uh, Megamorphton, thank you for the 56, 57 months of tier 1, saying it torches me that I never beat Breath of the Wild and feel the need to, uh, get its full experience before I play Chase of the Kingdom. So I have no choice but to watch every stream muted or not pay attention to them as much as I want to stay, uh, say fuck it to spoilers. You could watch a, um, a playthrough of Breath of the Wild. Like a short one or like a, uh, or like a, like one that just gives like a quick recap.
Definitely gonna need the fairies. I, I mean, yes, you can watch mine too. I mean, yes, that is the only option to watch mine. Damn it. I was catching that fairy. Alright, uh... There's actually plenty to do up here. Though I'm- I'm a little bit confused as, like, the point of some of this. It actually kind of feels like a puzzle getting from one Sky Island to another. Oh, you know what? You know what I forgot to do? I need my signature... my signature weapon here. There we go. Or my signature, uh, my signature defense. Hopefully it doesn't slide. Oh, that's why it's sunk down like that. Okay, hopefully I can make it. I see a piston on that on that area. Are you serious? This is definitely gonna work this time. Oh my god! Well, I killed him! That's gotta count for something, right? Okay. Should we be able to get height by putting the fan on the bottom? Oh, that's a good question. Uh... Let me hold some zone eye stuff. Uh... Some construct hold. And we'll go- we'll put a captain's horn in there too. How would you hit it, though? I think if I were to do a jump, uh, a jump dive, then it would work. Anything new? Can I take picture? Can I take pictures of these? There, that's the big thing. No, I thought there was a, a chapter in the Hyrule Companion for uh, for Zonai devices. Sm oh no! Dum dum da dum da 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 da. Oh no! A light. Actually, ooh, the light would be. I could just attach that to something on my, on my person. I'm a, I got a rocket car. I just need a steering wheel. Oh. Okay. Why is this here? I can change the angle. Supposedly, that would get me over to other places. I apologize for not making progress or accomplishing the goals I set out to do, but... This is... Wait. There's no rock here. Seek the crystal connected to the beam, and offer it at a shrine. Okay... Switching with his 52 months here one saying, Breath of the Tears of the Wild Dumb of the Nuts and Bolts. Love the streams and YouTube vids, Tomothy. Thank you. Oh! Okay.
Alright, I've created the pathway necessary. Anything guarding this crystal? Gyroscope without gyroscope. You can still use the gyroscope, I, I noticed. Uh, fill up on peppers. <gasps> Hardy radishes! Yes! The best cooking item in the game! Temporarily increase your max hit points. I got my green crystal and I'm walking back, walking back over this here bridge. I got my green crystal and I'm walking back, I'm walking back across the bridge. Going over the bridge to bring back my crystal. Maybe this has other uses, I don't know. If something- oh my goodness, there's a chest on a rope there. Gotta get the chest because I'm very strange. Oh, the ants go marching one by one, hurrah, hurrah. The ants go marching one by one, hurrah, hurrah. The ants go marching one by one, put the crystal down and then you're done. And they all go marching down. You who offer the crystal, I grant you light that banishes evil. All right, well... Unexpectedly, this also works because I could just jump down to the Great Plateau whenever I want to. Ah! Oh, no, that works. Oh, do I have to go inside or is it just going to give it to me? League. Son of a biscuit. You could have just gave it to me. I mean, they could have just given it to me. It would have been fine. Raru's Blessing. Jinodok Shrine. <laughs> Holy cow! Ooh, that gives you 25 attack power. Why do you persist in knocking when the missus and I are about to copulate? Take this light sphere and get out. I see you also robbed us of our diamond. I am calling the police. Get out of our house so that the missus and I may copulate. Of course you have to enter. How else would you get free chest? You know what? You got me there. So that's interesting. Ooh, I wonder if... Interesting. What's this? Oh, device uh, dispenser. Oh, it tells you what they give. Oh God, it's a gacha machine. Okay, couple things I gotta do. I gotta go back to this bridge and get, and get that. I can head over here and get a, uh, a shrine that's actually on the Great Plateau. And then we'll continue to make our way over. Let me get that chest. Where? The bridge was over here. I'm assuming the rarer of an item you put in there, the better stuff you get. Dazzle fruit. Okay. So now the question is, where was that chest? There it is. Two, 
far down. Wait, where's the rope connected to? I'M GONNA THROW UP! Okay. So let me try doing this. Okay, I can grab that. Dang. All right. I'm gonna have to try it this way. Oh no, it just collides into that. Okay. Who's ready for a physics-based timing puzzle? Starring me, Regret. Still hits it. <sighs> if only I can get it to fit in there. But it's just a little too far away. Okay, what if I... I know I have to break the rope, but the problem is the second I break the rope, then... It's it's over. It's gone. I can't look up any further. There's the chest. Can I climb this? Yes. Okay. What a shit show this is. Whatever the intended way was, I laughed at it. Now what was in here? A very old map shows a marked spot. What could be there? Location of the old map has been marked in your map. Interesting. That, I believe, was 100% worth it. We Now, where are the pirates? I didn't even have to go to, uh, to that area. Dazzle fruit. I wonder what this is all about. The ability to, and I quote, LAUNCH! No oh, shit, I fell asleep watching Steven Mount play TikTok. Your rendition of Rocket Man woke me up! <laughs> uh, there's a oh my god, wait a minute. Guys, I think the Borg are here. I assume that's meant to launch me. That's the area I came from. There's another island over there, but it's small. Let me check that out real quick.
I'm glad they didn't just outright kill me. Uh... A single apple tree. A lot of apples on it, though. I wonder, could this be... a Korok? Ample apples. Once I get weed, I'll be able to make that apple pie. Or... What do we have here? There is something Korok related on this island. It has nothing to do with the apples, though. I don't think, anyway. What is that symbol? That symbol. Oh, God! <laughs> uh, I see something for us to fight down below. Shoot it? Bingo! Let me try climbing onto it. See if that do anything. Uh, Game Master! <laughs> yep, I just need to get onto it. Alright. Uh, we're gonna go fight Cubics again. I'm running out of arrows. <gasps> He's coming up here! close. I can't hit him until he comes down. That's a new arra arrangement. Interesting, I can grab these. Okay. Can I grab him? Ow! Thank God I just grabbed all those apples. Is he ever gonna come down? I even do with this? Fusing them together does nothing. He's not coming down either, is the worst part of this. Someone had a good idea!
I ran out of, uh, I ran out of juice. The fact that I can affect him with this is very unique. Oh boy. Alright, let me get this and then run. Ooh, he had an old map! You unfortunately cannot eat the bomb flower. Okay, hold on. What do I have? I've got instant up, I've got fuse, I've got grab, and I've got rewind. <gasps> oh my god! I can't pull that one out. I can pull out other pieces though, it looks like. Oh, he goes so fast. I see, I'm making safe spots for myself. Well, I got, well, I, we've been found. All right, uh. Part of the issue is that I'm running out of, uh, out of arrows. Oh, there we go! If I took enough pieces out of him, then he'd just fall apart. Alright, what's he becoming now? A construct. Oh! Okay. He just rails into you, huh? Hey. Able to pick up one of my arrows. I do find it funny that you could- oh god. Oh god, I almost missed that. Here we go! Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Okay, we're back to this. Lord! 
Crunch! It's rewind time. What's it becoming now? The cube. There's probably an instant way to beat all these different things, but for the life of me, I can't. I, I, I'm not smart enough at the moment. Well, that didn't work out the way I wanted it to. I figured the best idea would be to take out the ones around him. Around the core, rather. Because if I do that, then the structure will fall apart. Oh boy. Consistently. Okay, up! Uh There we go! Shattered! There we go! I gotta figure out their actual weaknesses, because it seems like each form has its own weakness. Alright. I think... Uh... Ho 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 ho! Oh! That's a good Royal Claymore! Uh... There are balloons tied to that one. I'll keep with this for now. I used up a lot of weapons during that. What's the deal with the balloons on these? There's also power cells. Is there anything above us here? I think it's just to bring me back up there. I want to go this way to get to the, uh, the, uh, the shrine that I saw in the underground. Whew. 34 damage. Hopefully it will last, it'll last a while. I at the very least want to get to- uh, I at the very least want to get to the Great Pirate Adventure. <gasps> Ooh! Well, the climate's even too cold for me like this. Huh? There we go. Oh no. Alright, and I know the- Yep! 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 Oh lord! Please allow me the opportunity to stand up. Oh! Get away from here! I at least want to get to get to the village of pirates. But there was also the matter of something that fell back here. I doubt I'll be able to reach that right now, but... Whew. All right. I think... Yeah, I lost where that shooting star was. Oh, 
but we have we should have a shrine over here if we're going if there's any indication based on the Okay, this is a little worrisome. Is there a cave under here, maybe? There appears to be some kind of entrance over there. An ice-like-like. -like. Oh, blue bunny man, you're just what I needed. Now I was hoping to get- you know what? Fair. That's fair. River of the Dead Waterfall Cave. Oh, there's like-like. Oh! And... Crystal. No idea what they're for, but I'm gonna get him. He taunted me, that's how I was able to find him. Is the waterfall itself dead? What the? Oh no! This is my last arrow. Where the hell are my fire fruit? I've got way too much stuff. Huh, that worked pretty well last time. Did he take my weapon? Oh, my spear broke, that's why. Plenty of bows, no arrows. Can I get by him? Yes. Whew. The weird thing is the leg likes in the, uh, the other area, uh... When I throw, when I hit them with fire before, they're, they're, they go bleh. You know, they go bleh. And then their, their, their little tongue thing would come out, and they go bleh. Bleh. Fire and water, the Tata Rock Shrine. Water in the fire, why? Alright. Not to understand. Alright, this should be safe, right? Yes. Thank goodness. We still got electro balls, but, you know, it's beside the point. Well, there's a reason for doing that. Imagine the reason would be blocking this. Uh, what's going on here? What is, uh, what's going on here? <laughs> I have to stop hitting A. Okay. I need a full-size one, though, so this has got to go. I assume I need a full-size one. Huh. 
Oh good, I can climb ice. A shield used by Zonai, made of Zonite. Uh, very durable and draws its stored energy most of 50! 50 defense! I think I'm gonna combine that with the glider! I don't think I can make that jump. You know that whole, like, have confidence, no confidence thing? No confidence. I do have an idea, though. Uh, I don't need to attach that. I could just do this. And then just jump and glide. Just jump and glide. I have all the trust in here? Yes. Ah, that one got destroyed. By what? I'm not sure. But I need- I, I apparently need all three of these. Box, metal, and uh... Or uh- Oh, I can't climb it. Okay, in that case... Remember that, and cancel, and then we... I'm just gonna attach this, just so it's easier for me. What does attaching the glider to the shield do? Makes it look cool. All right, the exit's up there. So one thing I need to do that's clear is day. Block that. Actually make your shield jump a little higher? I didn't know that part. My basis for it was how I usually judge these things, because it looks cool. Much as I would like to think that this would cinch onto the edge, no problem. I don't think it will. I can't see. I figured that was gonna- OH, THE BOX! The fragile, fragile box! I tried. I sense your frustration, Link. Because I too feel feel the same frustration. You and I are one and the same. Remember that one game, uh, that one, like, prop hunt-esque game I played? Where everybody is a box, and you gotta figure out which- who is what, and you, and you can shoot them. Okay. Huh. 
it was it was a prop hunt s game, but I, I but it but it wasn't prop hunt. And like that. Does the ice block float? Maybe. But that's not the issue here. <laughs> it's Cryonis! Everyone's favorite ability. The ice one, that everybody remembers, myself included. I didn't forget, shut up. I was afraid that was gonna hit me. I don't think this is the right way to do this, but it's just kind of how I'm doing it. Oh, so close, all right. Can't get that from here, huh? Alright. I still can't get that from up here. What am I to do? So much for that. I did it again. How am I unable to grab that? Is it a height thing? Ice kind of floats. No, but I need that to get up there. Grab this. Don't put it in the fire. That's an important factoid right there. Attach it there. Why can't I grab that? Whoa! Why did that happen? Now I can't grab that because it's too high. Oh my god, I gotta get the- oh my god. I'm an idiot.
I do need that to melt. I've had the ability the entire time and chose to do NOTHING with it! <laughs> Remember, Link weighs eight apples. Which implies the apples are either very heavy in Hyrule What? Have I... Has this been here the whole time? I pulled that out first thing. This is the first thing I pulled out. Even if, so here's the thing. Even if I remembered to use Ascend, it wouldn't have worked, only because I, for, uh, I forgot a block. Ooh, ice conducts electricity, good to know. At least in the context of this game it does. I never think about Ascend! I need to think about Ascend more. Why must you continuously interrupt us during sexy time? I'm not even dancing around the point anymore. I tell you, I solved the trade. Yeah, go nuts! If you had alternate ways of, uh, of, uh, beating certain shrines, leave them in the, the chat of the comments. Alright. I'm gonna go to... This Sky Shrine, and then we'll finally start heading on over to the shore. I lifted the ice block up and down, then used it, uh, and then used Recall. There's a limit to how high you can get it, though. Southeast? That launcher is actually in, right in the direction I want to go. Yep, Ascend and, Al and Alolan Marowak evolves at night. Whatever you do, do not delete Zelda's pictures. I don't plan on deleting Zelda's pictures. Something saw me up here?! Oh my god, I'm landing on the Temple of Time. Or next to it, rather. There's a chest up here. Of days gone by. Let me see. Nope, okay. Nostalgic fabric. Tough fabric bearing a nostalgic design. It looks like it could be used to make a paraglider. Hey! Huh. 
All right, we head this way. I'm gonna try to get the towers as I'm go as I'm heading uh, in that direction. So next stop is gonna be that tower over there. Imagine like imagine if you're like on this. Actually, how would that work? I imagine the second you let go of one, it would just flip up and then you'd start plummeting. Kind of curious if uh, if the Sheikah like harvested the guardians. A silent shroom. Shh, it's a silent shroom. I also can't wait to find more uh, more outfits. There is also a shrine up there. Somewhere along the Great Plateau is the door that the goddess was talking about. Though... Given something we didn't have in a previous Zelda game, I would not be surprised if whatever that door is in the Great Plateau... What was that? Oh! Ooh, 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 ooh! Okay, um... No! Oh my goodness! Okay, uh, 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 uh... Monado reverse? See ya, bitches! Where did you come from? Well then. Gives me a nice little gliding tour over to the- there's a maelstrom in there. What the hell is that on the bridge? That's a dragon. There's- there, no- there's no- no doubt in my mind, there's just a dragon on the bridge. Yup! 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 Nope! Yup! This'll be interesting. I'm good at timing that, if nothing else. That's Hydra! Given that its heads are on fire, it's probably weak to cold or water. Oh, wait, 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 what the hell was the name of that boss in the first Zelda game? Uh, it was like the very first boss of the first dungeon. Whatever that is, is what- is what that boss is. Gleok! That's a Gleok. No doubt in my mind that that's a Gleok. I remember this tree. This tree was already felled before the upheaval, right? I just realized this is essentially uh What game was it? This is essentially uh uh like <laughs> World of Warcraft Cataclysm. <laughs> That's right. In chaos and in in, uh, in, uh, in Canes of Hyrule was a Gle it was Gleokenspiel. I just want to go get the rush rooms. I think my favorite battle uh, from that was uh, was Robo. Funnily enough, you glide faster than you run. Yeah, ha ha! You found me! Bye bye!
I have a little bit- Oh my god! I think I'm gonna steer clear of that caravan. You go through arrows so quickly in this game. There's smoke over there. You know what they say, where there's smoke, they pinch back. A bygone era when I first started watching YouTube. How's the game so far? I don't want to stop. It is midnight. I should probably go to bed. I don't want to stop. I might combine streams editing wise. Or release like the full VOD sooner for some of them. Because like we've uh, it's it's hard to tell because like there's there's been some stuff that I want to include. But there's also been like I don't know, like editing all of them down into like one video would I feel like would get kinda kinda cumbersome. Especially for such a long game. Like I, I feel like I feel like the return wouldn't be worth the uh the return wouldn't be worth it. How many temples have you done so far? Uh, zero? If you're talking about shrines, I've done ten? I love just- I could see a floating island above me. You have an editor that might help? Yeah, but again, I don't know if it if it would be if it would be worth it because uh like payment the amount of cost to pay the editor versus how much I'd make off the videos. Listen, man. Pirates. The Poplar Foothill Skyview Tower. Is there anybody here? I can understand the Sheikah shrines being. I, I can, yeah, I can understand the Sheikah shrines being, um, uh, or the Sheikah towers being. Uh, oh my god. Help! Help! Alright, hold on, let me do that. let me get the map st started first. Guys, I don't want to alarm you, but I think that might be Toilet Hand. Oh, it's on the Frith, so whatever's down there I have to take care of. You alright? Hey, uh, help! You okay there, buddy? Whoa! Oh. You! What are you doing in a place like this? No, it doesn't matter. Could you just let me out? What's wrong? <laughs> I set off a trap in the ruins and now I'm stuck. Oh, what a mess. Oh. You, uh, can you see a switch? If you press that, you should be able to get me out of this. There's a cave entrance over there. I got in that way. I'm begging you, mister. Just, I'll be waiting for you. And please, help me. How do you intend for me to get out? Should have gone to the other thing first. Uh, is the only way out for me to warp? Because if that's the case, I have to go all the way back here! Ascend? You think it'll work this far down? Oh my god, it does!
Where's the tower? Where was the cave entrance? Over here somewhere? So ascend will work as long as I'm not in the depths, right? Hang on, I gotta go back over there. I should have used ascend from where uh, from where I was standing, so that way I could just could have just walked straight. Uh! Everyone forgets ascension, ascension, ascension. It's fun for a girl and a boy. Okay, cave entrance over this way. Yonder cave entrance. I'm glad they didn't attack me. I would have felt hurt. I would have felt betrayed. I think these, yeah, these guys always lead you to, uh, I can't remember what they're called. They've got, like, Rupee or something in their name. But these guys always lead you to cave entrances. A restless, restless cricket. Brat cap, brat cap, brat cap, brat cap. Thank you! I knew you'd rescue me! I don't have much, but uh, please, take this! What about what's in the chest? This one lured me into the trap. I don't even want to look at it anymore. Do whatever you want with it. Wait, I don't have time to chat! I have urgent business at the tower! I have to go! Thanks again! Was there just a purple rupee in there? Oh wow, you're like right under the tower there. Hello again! Oh. Hello there, mister! Thanks again for saving me. I was only in the area in the first place to do maintenance on the tower. The terminal wasn't making anything happen due to the humidity, but I fixed it in a jiffy. Unfortunately, getting stuck caused all kinds of delays. I need to hurry to the next Skyview Tower. I probably caused trouble for my friends at the construction company, so I'm going to get moving as... Elmerson! He's part of the Bolson Construction Company! Or Hudson at this point. So I'm going to get moving as soon as I calm down. Yep, we got that. Alright, here we go. Tentacle, tentacle. <laughs> I like how the tentacles don't even trust you to plug the damn thing in. Ooh, I want to land on that star island. <laughs> NFC, baby! Actually, no, not NFC. Scanning! Setting the map data back. Surface map updated. <laughs> what do you think that giant maelstrom is? Yeah, that. <laughs> This is, it's fairly pretty. It's etched with ancient Hyrulean text. You cannot read it. Which means... Wait, 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 
Does this do something, maybe? I'll try it to see if it works, but... It didn't have any sort of, like, marking or anything. It, it didn't have any sort of, like, thing where it's like, Oh, yeah, this is definitely something you can do. How far away am I from the, from the tower? I'm in the Sky Island still. Okay, I can just... There it is. Now upload that to Google Translate. Excuse me, the search engine is Pura, and it's Pura Translate. Incoming, incoming, uh, 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 transmission. Pura is now the CEO of Google. Gcom Shrine. I'm gonna, tr I'll keep the picture and see what happens. How far, if anybody's still here from Steven and Mal's stream, how far did, uh, did, uh, they get? Because I know it was their first stream. Ah, oh, dang. Built for rails. Built for rails. I could just grind! Ooh, uh, maybe not on a sh uh, the only shield I have is... Yeah, no, I think I'll just do this. You'd think the grinding sound would get grating after a while! And you're right! What? I can't hear you over the grinding sound. Sticky elixir. Oh my god. This is that the first game definitely needed that. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Yeah. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh! I see what I needed to do and I'm a fool. Hold on. Slow your roll there, buddy. Okay. It's one side. Yes, we are making a TIE fighter. Wait! Get back here! If I do that, hold on. Ah, hold on. I do like my piece of modern art. Dang it.
Okay, 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 okay. Attach! Okay. Well, thank goodness. Hopefully this works. It didn't work. I'm doing well. I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm okay. I'm not okay. This is going awfully. It's not sliding. Oh, come on! Well then! Does it take away a full heart every time I drop like that? Uh... Oh, I could have rewound and gotten back up. Uh, forgetting my abilities. That's... That's just me. <sighs> All right, trying a different one. Good enough. It's moving, okay. Yeah! Alright, hopefully this works. Yeah! All right, what's going on up here?
What the heck? Okay. Okay. I have the basis for a plan, but not much else. Got it. You produce so much glue on this thing. Now, it's time for everyone's favorite game. Help! All right, the rules of the game are simple. Hope to God that this is lined up properly. Um. turn these off. No, that one can stay, actually. That That's correct. This one. And this one. Have been deemed too heavy. by the Regulatory Commission. All right, let's do it, come on. There we go. Please grab. Isn't it weird that steel just seems to weigh so much? That's not right. But steel is heavier than feathers. There we go. Thank <laughs> you. 
Oh! But, but steel's heavier than feathers. Young guy streams. Lemmy. Oh, I see what the issue is. Yep, he's got a Twitch channel. Twitch.tv slash Lemmy. Oh, oh, oh. Don't knock it over, please. Okay. All right. In a sort of Zoidberg fashion, maybe now it'll work. Takes a while to construct some of these things. All right. I'm glad these are these have infinite power when you're in the, uh, the these areas. All right. Is it light enough? Come on! I. What am I doing wrong? Uh oh. Okay, hold on. I think it just needs a better run up. I need the middle fin, though. Otherwise, it'll fall off at the end. Because basically what's happening here is a, is a track change. Nope. What am I missing here? No, Link, in terms of physics puzzles like this, Link is weightless. Let's try this. Hold on, this could still work. I miss. I was going to rewind time, but I got stuck. And all this resets, good lord. Idiot, idiot! I see what I need to do. Absolute moron. Sometimes when you're looking at a puzzle, if they give you too many pieces, you start to interpret solutions that aren't there. If this doesn't make it up here, I'm going to be I'm going to be furious.
We. I probably could have shield grind my way over there, but I didn't want to. Like that. That shield is a fifty defense shield. Ah, that puzzle took you so long that we were actually able to finish. Here, take your blessing of light. It's it's weird actually because uh, the only time when you can uh, the the only time when we can actually copulate is when you enter, and we usually don't have enough time. <laughs> well, I finished. Oh, that poor wife. Monorail. Mo that was six rails. That was not a monorail. Uh oh. Yeah. Whoa, 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 whoa! Darn it all! President Hudson, are you okay? Oh no, what have I done? Alright, I'm sorry. Sorry, President Hudson, I won't let you fall over again. It's unforgivable. It's all your fault, Sterling, but you like that? Yes, I know it's just a sign, but I have a great respect for President Hudson, so I pin the blame on you! Unforgivable! You haven't heard about Mr. Hudson? He's the president of our construction company. He's the one appointed by the princess herself. She placed him in charge of putting materials, caches all over Hyrule, and now he's shouldering the land's restoration. Of course, he's also the founder of the Hudson Construction, and besides all that, sorry, what's all this? Hey, I'm right in the middle of President Hudson's ep epic tale of heroism. Well, fine, what was I doing before? I don't want the others getting jealous, so I have to spread this around. But President Hudson gave me an extra special mission. And that is to put up these signs all over the place, let everyone know that, uh, that Hudson construction is a big deal. These aren't ordinary signs you can clearly see. These portray Mr. Hudson himself, uh, in detail, noble, glorious detail. It's unforgivable to even let one of these fall over. And so, <laughs> I've pledged to support him! Don't worry, Mr. Hudson, I'm here for you. But I can't sit here forever. I've got, I've got so many more signs to spread around. I don't know what to do. Try letting go. What? Are you- are you- are you going to support him? Alright, I'll let go. Whoa, unforgivable! <laughs> President Hudson doesn't warn you. Huh. What is it? I need to stay focused. President Hudson might topple over. Try letting go. Mm -hmm. What? Are you gonna support him? Alright, I'll let go. President Hudson, I'll support you. I'll support you, President Hudson. I'll support you. I'll be your best employee ever. I'll support you, President Hudson, no matter what. No matter what, I'll support you, President Hudson. President Hudson. How's the president standing? That was brilliant. I never would have thought of it. Oh, right, let me get him secured while he's still standing. Just put us right there and get that fastened. And... Perfect! With your help, President Hudson has dump uh, standing firmly in place. There's a dragon in the background. Fills my heart with joy seeing him do so well on his own. Take this with my thanks. 20 rupees. Also, you must be hungry after all that hard work. Let me give you a little something I made myself. Electro Shroom Rice Balls. Oh, but I still don't feel like I thank you enough. Here's a little something for my premium collection. A special gift for me to you. A sleepover ticket. A lodging voucher uh, for a regular stable bed. A, rewarding, uh, a reward for collecting pony points. Spend it at a stable and, and get some rest and recover fatigue from travel. Oh. Now I can go uh, to other places and put up more signs. And with that, I'm off. It's a bit of a loony. Ooh. What the f- I used up all of my stamina running to the edge and then jumped. You gonna you gonna drop him or? Oh my!
my god! Never mind! Don't have any arrows, so not much I can do there. The thick, foggy jungle. Thick jungle. Thick. Thickelodeon. These flowers I can grab? Nope. I don't want to go into the thick of the jungle yet. I got a mission. Sent on a mission from God. I am, however, beginning to wonder if, uh... The... Scan ability... Or the, the, the radar ability is still in this. Uh, hold on. There's a picture of a mighty thistle. Oh, that would that would have been good for my intro to photography class. Whoa, yo, what? A Pagos Woods excavation site. Breaking each of these lasers causes move. Oh my god, no, there's tiny little carts now. Guys, there's tiny little carts now. Let me just try this. There we go. I'm actually kind of surprised it didn't lock me in here. Because that would have been a really good lesson to remember to do this. Also, that, that that particular puzzle was very easy. Oh man, here's the problem. I need more ammo, and these guys have it, but I'd I prefer to pick them off from afar. Let me just start attacking them and hope for the best. I need my- I need my big shield. Did he throw another guy at me? Oh, he's got spark. He's got, uh, he's got the spark. He's got the power. Yeah. After all is said and done! My Boko Reaper! 
What happened there? I hit the spark nut. Oh, and I'm down here again. Can't believe I used up all. Well, no, never mind. I can believe I used up all my fairies. That is very believable. On brand, on point, on target. The moblins used to be super easy to take care of. Because if you hit them with a big one, they just collapsed. They felt like a house of cards. <laughs> I don't have a shield. One dead. Two dead. Sturdy long stick. Actually, I could I can uh make use of this immediately. Ooh, ex I got an extra durable stick, which means. I could probably mount it with something that gives me a ton of attack power. Can you, can you? <laughs> this is gonna be interesting, okay. Son of a bitch! Can you fuse stuff while it's in your inventory, or does it have to be on the ground? That was not a one-shot. I, uh, I had two hearts left. I'm determined now because I'm running low on equipment and those guys have equipment. Damn it. Got his weapon. Oh, fuck. God, I wish they could attack their allies. There we go. Good old combo right there.
Okay. Extra durable stick. Uh, I use I use this. We'll make a, I'll, we'll make a trident. It's it's trident true. <laughs> now I just gotta contend with the archers. See, oh my God, there is a guy there. It almost got me. I wouldn't if I were you. I wouldn't. A spiked boko bow. Uh. I know I don't have any arrows left. Whew. I already got the Boko Bow. Okay. I just saved that picture for whatever reason. Keep the old picture. There's mem there's memories and history there. Like the history of trunks. A gnarled wooden stick. Very swingable stick made of a hone drying branch. It's great. Attack power is much greater than that of a normal stick. Oh no. Oh no. Yeah. Oh no. I thought it was like a club. I'm trying to be careful so I don't accidentally hit the bombs. Mighty Thistle. Okay, okay. I think... I don't... Oh my god, what the hell are you?! Okay, okay, hold on, hold on. Let's wait, let's settle this. That doesn't do a lot of damage. Bombs. Why am I being attacked by trees? There's another one! He's not putting himself out. Who thought this was a good idea? <laughs> I like how there's just lizards living on them. It's called an Evermean. Oh my god. Raise your hand if you're expecting the trees to come alive today. Saint Jesus. There's another Gliok. That's an electric Gliok. Wait, are these not collectible?
They are. Why couldn't I get a picture of one? Ah, oh, the camera's weird sometimes. Dang, that looked like wheat. It's a shock shrine. It's a shock. You're scoping, not camera. Good points. Hopefully they'll come back when I'm done with the shrine. Ever mean? Why? Long or wide? Um, okay. I like how it just glided on the rail as opposed to rolling. That's definitely gonna come back. Golf time! Uh, I am gonna be trying to keep a lookout for a, uh... For a who's a what's it. Chest, for a chest. Cause that's the end right there, there's the chest. Fun. I, this one's fun based solely on the fact that it's just like a, a nice little like physics demo, you know? I see what I need to do. Paddling the school canoe. You better believe that's a paddling. All right. Uh. Better get ready, because I probably have to grab this thing. Got it. Who? Context sensitive glue, a sneaky elixir. Is that everything in here? Yes. Come on, man, you did that one so fast. Like, there's, we're, we haven't even started foreplay yet. Come on. May the blessing, may the light of blessing, whatever. We're gonna get busy now, get out. Well done. All right. I'm almost to the shore, but I think the town I want to go to is further this way. I guess we're heading towards the Gleok. I'm like I'm gonna keep like doing a variety of like things here and there like uh like the like just if I come across stuff or if there's shrines like there's one up there. Let me see if I can get a good view of it from down here. Probably not gonna fight the Gleok yet. A saffronia tree. Ooh! Hello! 
What beautiful scenery. Actually, before that... Endure a carrot! Savak! Mm. Oh, you are quite the handsome Vo, aren't you? To meet in such a romantic place, could you be the Vo I was destined to fall in love with? No, no, I can tell just from the look on your face. You do not come here in search of your one true love. That's too bad. Still, in a place as magical as this, I do b uh, believe I will finally meet the handsome Vo of my dreams. Oh. Until then, let me tell you a rumor I heard about cherry blossom trees. Apparently, there is a strange creature called a Satori that is sometimes seen near the such trees. I've never seen it myself, but I really want to. I heard that a Satori likes fruit. I guess I should have brought some uh, ki kind of fruit with me, huh? I guess those are the types of trees. The Satori. Or the... There's horses here! Oh! Excuse me, horses! I thought one of those had really short legs, like it was a Shetland pony or something like that. That's not what I wanted. That's not what I wanted. Thick stick club! You got me on the backswing! Talk so for the help. That could have gone badly if you hadn't turned up. Uh. I've give you. Uh, I've got to give you a little something for saving me, right? Hope this helps. Uh, a hasty simmered fruit. Uh. The name's Kalisa. I'm a legendary treasure hunter of the Gerudo. Nice to meet you. Have you heard about the strange phenomena all going on all over the regions of Hyrule? Uh. Islands floating in the sky and caves opening up everywhere. It's a dream come true for a treasure hunter. Mm. As a legendary treasure hunter, I am more than happy to share some tips with you. The key to making new discoveries is being able to get somewhere high up. A cliff, ruins that have fallen from the sky, as long as it's up high, it'll work. Ah. So get high up and look around. You're bound to discover all kinds of things. I'd better get going, but I hope we meet again. Savork. Ooh, ooh, that, that's really helpful. After all is said and done! If only I could get somewhere high up! As a rock falls in the background and I'm drooling with my Monado reverse time. Glad I could avoid the Gleok as well. Ooh, I think I see the town! Yeah, there are definitely ships parked over there. <laughs> Monado undo! That was a good one. Ooh, detour. Do I have anything metal on me? Dragon's Head Island. The music changed! And it got foggy! It's one of those MOAs. Where was that building I saw? It's constantly thundering here. Ooh. Ah, slick when wet, huh? 
Oh, they did do a, one another positive change to climbing that I like there. I do have this, though. Now, is that a cloud or is there something above me? can't see anything is the problem. A light! That's the sun, never mind. Oh, I'm, yeah, I'm in the storm cloud. Dang! Alright. We'll try this detour another time. When I'm able to see. There's probably something hidden in there. And by probably, I mean, like, de you know, definitely. Do glow flowers help? I doubt with fog. Hey, a stable! Or, uh, at the very least, an inn. Joju Uu Shrine. I, I wonder if this is a, I wonder if this is a shrine about falling. Because he was saying his name and it, it was recorded audi uh, audibly. So as he was recording, he goes, It's the Joju Shrine. Either way, it's a lot of ooh. The Joju Uwu Shrine. Building bridges. Jeff Bridges. Okay. Hmm. Huh. That didn't work out quite right. Yes. I did it. Oh, interesting. Ah, oh, damn. Not that one. This one. Oh, I see. So it'll like it'll give like a range for it, but if in the middle of uh, putting it together, if it can't put it together, then it won't. Kind of looks like a Jacob's ladder, honestly. Get on the ladder! <laughs> One side, another side, another side. Oh. Let me try something, then. No, that makes it way too short, I think. Well, I can't even attach it like that, anyway. I think I did have it right before, but it just, for some reason it just wasn't attaching. I'm an idiot. Atta if I attach it to the top, then it wouldn't have- uh, I wouldn't have had issues. Glad to know when your stamina runs out, you don't fall off the ladder, you just can't do the jump. Uh... I still haven't found the chest in here yet, so... Suffice to say, it could be somewhere close by. Ooh. Hit. 
That's strange. Oh, I can't grab that. Okay. Oh, I see what I gotta do. I was on the right track, I just didn't execute it properly. Cause it's the weight of the block! Giving you all the tension! The weight of the block! Weight of the block! How do you feel about the game so far? I'm enjoying it! Like, this is a, like... Breath of the Wild was awesome! This is a much needed improvement! <laughs> Large Zonite. Uh, that is all the, all the treasures, okay. All right, that time, you that time you gave us just enough time to finish. And yes, actually, this these are all my shrines, so. You miss Revali's Gales and Movement option all the time! However, I do like, um, Ascent as an exit option for caves. That is a good one. Oh, yeah, let me, uh, let me head down here. I can pick up some side quests while I'm at it. The lakeside stable. I don't have a horse, but when I do, oh baby, when I do. Anybody with side quest? Beetle! <sighs> Let's see, what's the news you should lock you as I close it? What's the news? Freezing temperature bring feathery shivers to the Rito. Rito village is facing a food shortage as cold winds make travel to the village dangerous for residents and visitors alike. It's awful. It sounds like anyone trying to get to Rito village needs to prepare themselves for harsh freezing weather. So much to read in these newspapers. Other stories? Blood Moon brings dangerous nights. Is your Breath of the Wild, wild, uh, wild date on the Switch? It should be. Be wary, dear readers, on nights when Blood Moon rises, so too do monsters ha that have been defeated. Hmm. Huh, this reminds me that researchers who studying the Blood Moon. They're really excited to visit a monster fort and examine the relationship between the monsters and the Blood Moon. Hope they're doing okay. I don't know if they'd be able to hold their own in a fight. Hmm. So much to read in the paper. Hmm. Is, he, is he your dad from Chulip? Uh, let me see. 26 friends, uh, 16 friends on live, all of them are playing Zelda. Alright, uh, I need to check my save data. Data management. It should be, it should be saved on the SD. I can see this being all the way at the bottom. Here's the Kingdom, Sword, Rayman Legend, Sam and Max. They're not really in any particular- oh, they're in order by, uh, file size. Pokemon Home. Breath- uh, Breath of the Wild. Doesn't really say what it is, though. Manage software? Breath of the Weth. Uh, nope. Either way, it should be in there. Delete. No! Hi, Beetle. Hey! Hey there, you a fellow traveler? <laughs> Wait, hold on. Hey there! Are you a fellow traveler on the journey of life? It's me, Beetle! If you forget, my beetle-shaped pack is right here to remind you! Wow! In this topsy-turvy world, there's only one direction to go! Forward! So when I travel, it's forward all the way! I can sell you bugs of the highest quality! And if you need anything else on your life journey, I can sell you that too! Short on rupees? Don't worry, I'll buy anything you don't want weighing you down! <laughs> 
And what better way to lighten up, uh, th lighten up than to sell your rocks? Gemstones in particular fetch a high price. Well, well, what'll it be? I have a lot of good stuff. I'm gonna need all of your arrows. All of them? Thank you! Definitely not gonna sell the, oh man. Actually, I am gonna sell the diamond. There's probably better uses for it later, I can get more. But I just want as many arrows as possible. Anything else I can get? Uh, Gino DePapa with 20 months of tier one saying hi to I was playing Pixelmon on stream. Try to catch a male Quagsar. What did I catch? What I'm naming it after you for your meme. Thank you. 100 bits from Gino DePapa. Thank you very much. For some reason, yeah, I don't know why. For some reason, uh, the some some alerts will activate and others won't. I apologize for that. Thank you for your business. Bye. Oh. Uh, forgive me. I do hope I wasn't in the way. The meal on this poster sure looks tasty, doesn't it? Mm. Simple recipe, just do some fresh seafood with Hylian tomato. Not, it's not just delicious, but nutritious. So once Ty comes home from, excuse me, once my husband comes back from his travels north, this is the meal I plan to cook for him. I used to get fresh seafood to make this from Lurland Village out in the east of here, Aww. but that was before it got attacked by pirates. What am I to do? Ah. Lurland is a lively, peaceful little fishing village. You can get there by taking the road east from the stable. <laughs> It makes for a wonderful vacation spot, too, especially if you're a fan of seafood. I don't think I'll ever forget the trip I took there with my darling Ty. Aww. It's awful to imagine that wonderful place falling victim to pirates. I heard that Laurel and Village just suffered a pirate attack, but I'm afraid I don't know the particulars. It does sound as though the attack sent all visitors scattering, however. Ugh, all those poor people. Aww. Laurel and Village is such a cheerful place. What's become of it now? Aww. I want to cook my... Yeah, we've heard this before. Or the caves. There's three giant, uh, three giant monster brothers. You back our caves. It's your first time in the area, sir. It's a little known fact that our stable receives orders from Princess Zelda herself. At her direction, we open a sanctuary for new animal species right across the ravine from here. Huh. Ordinarily, visitors can't reach it easily, but with a telescope or, or the like, you might be able to snatch a glimpse of it. Anyway, once again, oh. you're a night owl, I see. Oh. Welcome to my stable. We deal in all sorts of things horse-related. We also double as an inn. Seems you're not a member yet. Oh. Our stable uses a stable association membership system, so you need to register if you want to use it. May I ask your name? Oh. Link. All right, Mr. Link. There. You're all signed up. Now, would you please, uh, would you like me to tell you about the stable system? I, th I already know. Ooh. Is that so? Well, then, once again, welcome to our stable system. Do you want to lodge with us? Cost 20 rupees a night? A uh, uh, Melania bed uh, will cost you 50 rupees. You sleep in a Melania bed, not only, will you, uh, not only will you wake up more energized, Melania the horse god may also share her a mystical message. This makes it a very popular choice among lodgers. But we don't offer such luxury to just anyone. The only, cus only customer with uh, at least seven pony points can use Melania beds. Now once again... Wait, what am I thinking? I'm completely forgotten to explain how pony points work. That's right, it's a reward system you could use. In short, every time you use a service, you get points. No matter what stable you go to, you can get points for lodging there, registering a horse, stuff like that. And now, since it's your first time at the Lakeside Stable, you get a pony point! Save up pony points, uh, earn a wag- Save up points, earn a wagon load of wonderful re uh, rewards for you and your horse companions. Ooh. Trade your pony points for prizes at the ledger over the uh, counter over there. Check out the ledger for prize details, member rules, and other information. Oh. The rain is almost constant here, but once in a while it does let up. Like now! When it's raining, the well behind the stable is, get, is too full for me to go inside. When the skies are calm, the water and the well disappears and I can give it a good scrub. Come to think of it, I should probably go and do that now. <laughs> Take care on the slip. Come back anytime! Link, welcome to our stable. If you catch a wild horse, you can bring it here and register it. Please visit the inside counter if you want to lodge with us. Now, how can I help you? 
Register horse? Oh, very original, the invisible horse routine. I'm crying invisible tears of mirth. How about you stop kidding around and go catch a horse? Horse. Approach from behind and hop on. Got that funny guy? Huh? According to our books, you entrusted a horse to us once before. Apologies. I'll go ahead and register any horse you had before. Ooh. Just a moment. Oh. I got Fafnir, I got Squibbles, I got Hoofer, and I got a Pona. I remember. Yeah, I remember that. Squibbles was the uh, was the. I kind of want to get Hoofer. So yeah, I got I so I have opponent the uh, the amiibo host, uh, horse. Fafnir was one I caught. Squibbles was from the royal, um, the what was it? The royal horse quest, and Hoofer was from the like the Ganon horse quest. Ooh. So you're not understood. Oh. Anything else? Actually, I'm gonna take Hoofer. Thanks for waiting! Oh. Speaking of which, do you know about whistling? If you get separated from your horse, you can whistle and it'll come running. But your horse isn't magic. Can't hear if you're too far away, so do keep that in mind. Oh. The rain is almost constant here, but once in a while it does let up, like now. Oh, the well, yada yada yada. Oh. Actually, did he say there's a, a well out back, right? That he can't get into while it's raining? Which means I can get into it now. Well? 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 I should probably pick that up, actually. Razor Shroom! Blowing cave fish. <laughs> Take a pic of the fish, it's a little wavy. He had nowhere to go. an apple down here. It's full of chestnuts. And a lemon. How hilarious would it be if you could just... <laughs> oh man. If you just pick up fish out of the water. <laughs> a topaz! Plenty of lizards down here too. Damn it! I should have gotten. I shouldn't have gotten too close to it before I took a picture. I realized as I was getting closer that I hadn't taken a picture of it. Oh dang! You know what these are? These are the. These are like the grottos from um, uh, Ocarina of Time. That's neat. All right. Well, now that I got Hoofer, I can take him along the path uh, to glory. Rewrite Hoofer. That's the wrong way. Yep. Sorry, Hoofer. We're going the wrong way. Giant horse. Oh no. All right, experiment time. Mom, I'm afraid that I got separated. That's far. My friend is uh, sending a smoke signal. I can't catch up to him. So tired, I can't move. I need to reach my friend. Oh, <gasps> what? Wait, Hoover, 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 Hoover! Okay. 
Oh, but how do- can I hitch it to him? Kufra had zero pull power? I guess that- okay, so I guess that was, that's a new thing. Let me get a different horse then. I'll get, uh, I'll get Squabbles. You know, I'll get a Pona. Uh, Hoover! Whoa. Welcome, Link. Do you want to register a horse? Take one out? How can I help? Take a horse. Uh, let me get Squabbles. Uh, actually, does a, a oh, opponent doesn't have any pull either. Uh, only Squabbles and Fafnir have got pull power. Ooh. <laughs> Thanks for waiting. Over, uh, yada yada yada, horse's top speed. Beetle believes in you! Okay, so how do I hitch him to this cart? I love the only how the only way to get off of this is to Squabbles? Take out a new horse, take out a new horse! Uh -huh. I wanna take a horse out, please! Oh. Uh, take out Fafnir! Squabbles, okay. Can't believe they managed to fish out- <laughs> I can't believe they managed to fish out my horse. Uh, receive reward? Yeah. Ah oh, yes, I'll be right with you. I'll get your pony point reward, right? Just save up two more points, you'll be you'll receive a towing harness. We appreciate your patronage. So wait, how can I get, read the ledger. Information on members. Points and rewards, pony point information. Need two points to receive a harness. Wait, I do have two points. Or it says how many I need, okay. Every time you use stable services. Staying in inns and registering horses, okay. Hold on. Whoa. Uh... Melania bed. Uh, oh. I can use when I have seven points. Regular bed. Oh. No, I'll pay. Oh. Morning. Uh. I'm just gonna rest here two times so I can get the hitching harness. God damn, every time I go to sleep, I've never been awake for one of these. Good lord. It's almost two in the morning, so I'm probably gonna end this, uh, I'm probably gonna end this when I get to Lurlin Village. Oh. <laughs> oh. Oh. I would laugh if it was an, if there was another one. <laughs> it, it only triggers when you're at an inn. Uh -huh. Reward available. Oh. 
If you want to get your reward, just, I keep it in the ledger. Come back anytime. Oh. Like, get your pony points rewards, oh. right? Your reward uh, for three points is a t What do you mean? Oh, did I just start off with one? Towing harness. Thank goodness. Harness is a type of horse gear that you can attach to various things. For instance, a wagon or an item if you like to tow it somewhere. You just save up two points, horse god fabric will be yours. It's a one-of-a-kind item you can bring to Hateno Diet uh, Shop over in Nakluda. We appreciate your patronage. Okay. So how do I use it? Uh -huh. Customize horse? Oh. Would you like to equip with a toning harness? Yes, please. Oh. Understood. Just give me a moment. Oh. Harness attached. If you attach the harness to a stable wagon, uh, you can transport bulky item, bulky oh. materials. Looks great. Oh. Ask me whenever you feel like you, uh, your horse needs a change of gear. Oh. I've been in that well. Thank you. Okay. <laughs> to make sure you don't fall out, we're going to attach you to the car, okay? Oh, thank God, the range of that is really long. There we go. Alright, let's see how the physics work with this. Huh. They're not terrible. I love the horse riding theme. Uh oh. Oh, thank goodness. It, it was a shy bull this time. Help! Oof! Oh, it's X to get off nor like a normal human being. B gets off like a madman. That's not what I wanted. All right. Lurlin can't be too far out here. Hopefully not anyway. Sorry, son, I'm on a mon- Wait, I saw you before! You're not supposed to be here! <laughs> Examine. Lurlin Village and Tuft- Tuft Mountain. King Tuft. Pirates invade Lurlin Village ahead. Those not confident in their pirate fighting abilities should not approach. I wonder if there's a way to take back Laurelin Village. Are you a traveler or a pirate? Better head back. I know that smell. You're a treasure hunter, aren't you? Probably think you'll strike it rich searching the debris from the Zonai ruins from the upheaval. I used to be like you. I was gonna shake all the treasure loose from those ruins and get my one in a million score. So I thought. You know what happened? The Zonai Survey Team crowded me out. They went and claimed all the best ruins for themselves. Cece and her smartly dressed sycophants. They took up, uh, they took up the hunt for Misko's treasure. In short, it's over. The bones are picked clean. You, uh, you're better off just going to Laurelin Village in the southeast. That's what I'm going to do. Kick back at the beach and enjoy retirement. 
But pirates are occupying the village and they're not letting anyone in. I really thought someone would have gotten rid of them by now by the time I got there. But I snuck a peek and there were still pirates all over the place. So anyway, I decided to head back to Lakeside Stable. At every stable, there's someone who's reading the newspaper. I figured the person could tell me when it's okay to visit Laurelin Village. I suppose I could kick their asses. See some abandoned carts? There's a cave over there. That cave system looks interesting, but I am... At this point, it's late. I've been live for six hours. This is definitely getting cut into two videos. Can I search this? Yes! Hey! Not bad! God damn it. In the fog, I saw this. And my, uh. My Ionios addled brain was like, <gasps> an ether deposit! <laughs> Surprise, there's a Bolson station over here. Oh ho! That's a shrine that that's overlooking Laurelin Village. There are definitely pirates there. What if you go down there and the first thing you hear is <laughs> Don't run a Squabbles. Squabbles. Okay. You're okay, Hans. Okay. <gasps> it's Bolson! We've destroyed the village. It's ruined. No way we're getting close to all those monsters around. Hmm? Why do I get the feeling we're being watched? Oh, uh, were you planning to visit Laurelin Village? You might want to take other plans if you value your life. Not to ruin your travel plans, but as head of the village, it's my duty to protect the locals and visitors alike. <sighs> you see over there? Monsters have taken over the village. I don't know if they're after food or supplies or what have you, but the minute they arrive, they started acting like they own the place. Oh. By some bit of luck, every uh, everyone from the village managed to escape in one piece. But, with their homes destroyed and nowhere to live, well, the villagers have scattered to the four winds. If only those monsters weren't there. Master builder that I am, I'd have those buildings fixed up in a jiffy. Hmm. There's certainly been an increase in monsters lately. I wonder if it's because of the upheaval. And they seem more aggressive, too. I never thought they'd be so bold enough to launch an attack from the sea. They're behaving just like pirates. As long as even a single one of them remains, it's too dangerous to go anywhere near the village. Ruffian infested village, which means this is what we're going to be doing next. However, what we're going to be doing now is getting a fast travel point back here. So, no matter where I go, uh, if I were to say explore in, uh, in the interim, just to kind of like, you know, pick up some supplies, get some arrows, get some money, get some uh, weapons, um... I can always just come back here for the beginning of next stream to start the pirate, uh, the, the pirate raid. Wealth, power, fortune, Gold Roger, the king of the pirates. The shrine in prison and purifies the ancient evil. You probably know this already, but we're just gonna get down to it and get busy. Wooden stick, long stick, and an old wooden shield. What was the title of this one? I oh. I can't attach stuff to there. Oh!
I didn't even realize it removed my clothes. All right. Well, first things first, I'm gonna need a bridge. Not exactly what I was looking for in bridge building materials. Constructs. Not my, not my bridge. Son of a bitch. Not long enough to be a bridge. I think this is meant to be cover, actually. Yeah, it didn't quite work out as well as I hoped it would. All the supplies that were in there are essentially gone. Climb this? Yes. Whoa, what? Where did that come from? <gasps> That's not fair. They're shooting lightning at the water. Ah, oh, for God's sake. Okay. The... Keep forgetting about Ascend. I will never remember Ascend. Is it called Eventiny? Proving Grounds Flow. No, it's not called Eventiny. Barrels didn't seem to have anything in them. All that was in there was a single arrow. Oh, there's another one. Oh, that's... It's not that there was a single arrow in there, it's that they fire them at me and then I can pick them up. For you to get to the ladder before you drown. You drowned. Okay, not my best moment. Let's just head over to this one. At the very least, I can catch up with it. I don't have a bow as part of this problem. Huh? 
Hi there! Got the ice fruit. There we go. I'm gonna take my horse to the old wooden bow. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna go get this guy. Hi there. You lost me, didn't you? It's all right, I don't know where I am either. else they fall into the water anything useful I don't see any more arrows so there we go Hey, knocking him into the water does great work here. There's one left. Where is he? There he is. I did it! Ding, ding, ding! Your equipment will be returned to you. Can I grab stuff from here? There are thorns. I doubt there's a variety, there's any good weaponry I could use from here. There is a, there are some exceptions though. As I do have a sturdy wooden stick. Uh, yeah, actually, hold on. Let me go ahead and destroy the fuse material. Let me get my fuse on. Hey, yes! <laughs> Nothing like a mace. Nothing like a mace. The Captain Two Reaper, a strong Zonai sword made out of Zonite. It resonates with the attached Zonai devices, uh, some, uh, to increase some of its uh, its attack power. I get rid of the long stick, and I'll attach it onto the end of this stick, therefore making double stick. It was kind of hard to get into the mood, with all of your constant combat and fighting in the background. Whatever, may the blessing, may the light bl of blessing, whatever. We're gonna get back to it. There's no more content anymore. Raid was, to yeah, Tony Locke's Pro Shielder. Whew. I owe my dog a, an entire day at the park tomorrow. All right, uh, yeah, let me go ahead and save. 
you enjoyed the, the stream uh, video, some uh, follow, subscribe, comment, do in a chat, and like. That's all I gotta say. I'm tired. I'm not gonna be able to get to sleep tonight either because I went to bed so, like, so early this morning. I woke up at four. Good lord. Uh, yeah, we could raid this guy. He's in a- oh wait, no, he's in Kakariko right now. We're gonna raid Matt Bragg, who's doing an uncapped, uh... An uncapped Tears of the Kingdom subathon. He's currently, this day, has been going for around 14 hours, so give him some of that time and his love, and I will see you all back here. Maybe tomorrow, if I really want to play more of this. We'll see. Anyway, I'll see you all next time. Later!